Yes guys, how's it going? How are you getting on? And welcome back to the channel. What are we, 25 to 9, so we've got a good uh, 2 hours, 25 minutes to go until the deadline. So plenty, plenty to discuss. Hope everyone is keeping well. Let me know where you are watching in the world, whether you're watching in Mumbai, Australia, Ireland, England. Let us know. Um, it's great to see everyone around the world when they do tune in. So please, please let us know where you are watching and uh, get the questions sent in below. And uh, I'll try and keep you entertained for the next two hours and 25 minutes or so. Shout out to William, one of the members in the chat there. As always, William, hope you're keeping well. Let's go. Let's get those green arrows in if you can at all. Um, if there are any members watching, get those green arrows in. And uh, hopefully we'll be seeing some this weekend. Good stuff. Who else have we in the chat? Uh, Prague Wall, hope you're keeping well, man. Moody to go well. FPL Cam as well, hope you're all keeping well, lads. Um, right. Um, We've lots to discuss. Jack as well in the chat. Good man, chat. And Moody is saying love from India. Absolutely love to see that. We have viewers from all over the world. Great to see. And mighty stuff as well. Quick reminder before we start off. We, we've 12 in the chat there. If you are watching, head on down there. Give the video a like. And um, get the questions coming in. And if you are watching and you're not subscribed, please do hit that subscribe button below. We're on the road to 6k subs. I'll keep the, the live sub count up beside us throughout this stream. Um, but I'd really appreciate it if you are watching and you're not subscribed. Please do hit that subscribe button below. We've seven game weeks to go until the rest of the season. Trying to get to 6k subs. It's possible. It's doable. But we've a lot of work on these streams to do. So hopefully we can hit it. Um, right. We're just going to start off proceedings as normal. Game week review. Game week 31 there. 71 points for the game week. Um, surprisingly, a game week rank of 1.1 million. I thought I did pretty good. Uh, apologies as well if you can hear the wind outside. It's extremely windy here in uh, in, in County Leitrim. Uh, it might be all right, but it's it's very windy. Hopefully, it's not picking up on the mic. But um, game week review as normal. Uh, Seventy one points for the game week. We've got Palmer, Garna maybe not Palmer, probably Garnacho, Darwin, and Eight Nori and Isaac uh, to thank for that green arrow. Bit of bit of bench jam uh, coming in with with Garnacho there. Uh, if you watched my video last week, I keep talking about this fella, Eight Nori. Just thankfully, it uh, it paid off with with, uh, with William, but um, or not with William. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm thinking of the members there with with it. Nori, uh, I was watching the Spurs game in Galway in one of the pubs in in, in town, and uh, when I saw Wolves, I'd, I'd slight hope that uh, Nori was going to be involved. And then when I saw his name, I just I couldn't. It, it's it's mad what the game does to you, but yeah. Anyway, seventy one points of the week, as you can see there on screen. I'm up to eighty three k overall. So um. It's happening. The green arrows are happening at the right time. Hopefully, we can push on now this week, and uh, fingers crossed, we can get close to maybe 60, 70k, 10k, 10k green arrow this week. I'd, I'd be very happy with that and build on that then for the free hit coming up in 34, and then the bench boost in 37. So let's see, let's see how we do get on. But yeah, that's how we fared out. 83 points to the game. If you want to let me know what you did score last week in the chat, do let us know. And uh, Moody is saying there, Ganacho sub came in clutch. He definitely did. And. Um, Lovely, lovely uh, differential there. He's just gone 10% ownership now. I'd say he's gone up a few percentage since that Chelsea game. But uh, he, he put me about, up about 30, 40k places. So really needed that Garnacho Hall. Unfortunately, we didn't get the result at the bridge. But it, it was a bad night as a United fan. Great night um, as an FPL manager. But yeah, that's how I fared out. Liverpool assets. We'll, we'll chat about them slightly for a bit. They were pretty disappointing. Kelleher, he was doing well all game until that Bradley on goal. Not much he could do really about it. Went through his legs. Darwin got a jammy enough goal there. Just happy he did get his goal. And a very, very quiet night for Mo Salah. But anyway, uh, captaincy is a big thing this week then as well. We need to see who we're going to captain. Um, I've, I've won. I've, it's probably going to be Palmer. I'm not fully locked in on him yet. Son is, is eyeing me up and, and uh, Mo Salah is as well. Haaland could be a nice differential shout as well if you're on cap. If you're looking for a differential captain compared to, to Salah, Son and Palmer. He could cause damage if, if it is confirmed he's starting this morning. I, I do think he will be. Um, he just uh, he just got his rest midweek. Good stuff, right? Um, that's how I'm faring out. So I, I won't get into my team just yet. Um, Bolu's asking uh, about team links. If you want to just throw it under my latest tweet on on Twitter, uh, Bolu, and uh, we'll we'll get that. I think I just posted it there. Uh, yeah, if you want to put it under this tweet, Bolu, just on my timeline. Get get the. Get the team sent in there, and we'll uh, we'll get through them as much as we can then before the deadline. Plenty of time, two hours twenty minutes. So we've uh, we've lots we've lots to do. Um, right, good stuff. Um, 
how are we getting on there in the chat? What's William saying? Get the likes in, lads. FP there, Donny Content Creator gone live this early first. Appreciate that, William. Get in there, hit the like like button below. Uh, let's see what we're on uh, sub count at the moment. Uh, as I said, trying to get to 6k subs. What are we on there now? 5623. If we could get close to 5700 before the stream, that's very, very, um, very am uh, ambitious, I think. But sure, look, um, we're up early. Hopefully, we're getting a few more new people watching us. And um, yeah, as I said, if you are watching and you're not subscribed, please do hit that subscribe button below. Right, good stuff. We'll start off straight into Draft Town with the clean sheet odds. Um, then we'll get into my captaincy pick and then um, we'll get straight into the questions then. As I said, anyone joining in now, if you want to send in your team under my tweet here, I'll, uh, I'll get through them as well on stream then as well. Good stuff. Right, City, Man City, 52% chance for clean sheet. Basically, right, I'm in, a, I'm in a dilemma at the moment. Right, we're going to get a poll going. Everybody's asking about the, the captains and uh, that. So we'll, we'll get that going. And uh, I'll get into my captain then. Um, game week 32, captain. Uh, obviously, Palmer, after his hat-trick, is the is a clear favourite. Um, who else have we? We've Haaland, uh, Son and Saka. Right, get those answers in there. We'll see what the story is with captaincy. I'm on Palmer, as I said, at the moment, um, or as well as show you this video on Instagram, and uh, get that out of the way <laughs> while while, uh, while we're chatting about captaincy, and then um, we will get straight into the stream then. Good stuff. Uh, right, cool, 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 cool. There. Right, just making sure we're looking all right here and everything is in order. I think it is up. Just looking on the phone. Yeah, good stuff. Right. Um, did I leave out Salah? Crap. Oh, yeah, I did. We're going to end that poll again. Apologies. Thanks for spotting that, Nick. Good man. Nick, as well, make sure you, you, you had a look at my um, at my message on Twitter I sent you with... Um, with the links to the Discord because he did become a member last week. I really appreciate that. Anyone who wants to become a member, hop on down there into the description and you can become a member. Get access to um, a Discord chat um, and one-on-one -on -one support with your team. Right, Salah Sun, before I mess this up again, Haaland and Palmer. Right, I put in Saka because my mind's on Saka, whether or not to keep him or sell him. But we'll chat about Saka in a bit then as well. Right, there we go. Salah Sun, Haaland, Palmer. Get the votes in on that again. Apologies for messing up the first one. Great start to the stream. Right, we'll get into the chat then as well. Um, how are we all? Anderson, hope we're keeping well. Tazlima, Linda as well. She's in the Patreon group. Appreciate you, Linda, for tuning in. Good stuff. Uh, Bolu, just put your team under this tweet if you want it rated. We'll, we'll, we'll put up a tweet on Twitter. Um, in the next few minutes, we'll get some on the timeline then as well. Moody, considering the sell Saka with the UCL games against Bayern coming in, thoughts? Yeah, on, on Saka... Um, I still have to decide on uh, what or, what what to do with Saka, uh, because I will be free hitting in thirty four. I can get Saka back in then. So if we get news that Foden is going to be playing in the centre again, if De Bruyne is is benched again, um, I could be very tempted to go for Foden. I might use because I have two free transfers to use as well. Um, so that could be an option there, and he does double in thirty seven anyway. So, um, yeah, I'm just going to look at at uh, Man City's. Man City's fixtures for the next couple of what am I doing here? The mouse is going mad, right? Um, Foden here. So, also by the way, did you see the jam on this person who got the highest highest uh, points last week? He'd Hallen captain, triple captain, and then Palmer vice captain on that. So, some return from the triple captaincy there with the vice captain pick, right? Yeah, Foden as Crystal Palace, Luton, and then I could probably get rid in thirty four. Yeah, for another double game we play on me on me free hit, get Saka back in. Yeah, so that could be an option. Crystal Palace and Luton. Um Arsenal have Brighton and Aston Villa. So maybe maybe I could get rid of Saka then and get Foden in. Depends on, on the team news to be honest with you. I'm I'm tempted to do that, but we, we shall see. Um Good stuff, right, let's see. Uh, what's Nick saying there? Curious who your favourite FPL YouTubers are, FPL Juice, so I find it. Juice are great lads. Um, I, I, for, when I first started out, I was on their podcast about two and a half years ago, and um, I really like Focal. If um, I'm, I'm good pals with Oscar, he's he's uh, he's uh, doing great things at the moment. Um, it's hard watching content when you're making content. Uh, to be honest with you, making content takes up 
the whole nearly the whole evening so i don't really have much time to watch watch uh, watch content but oscar is doing great andy andy's obviously the, the absolute goat and um, harry and raptor are, are the big lads as well fpl fran is good as well um of some videos i've seen of him but the juice lads they're doing something different i love their their kind of pod podcast aspect and they're they're not too serious as well with fpl but um yeah juice um who else and the uh, Oscar, all those lads, the big lads anyway. Um, but yeah, I appreciate that, Nick. Shout out to the Juice lads for for putting putting you my way then as well. Good stuff. Right, back to the chat then. Uh, Nick, appreciate that for um, getting a bit of chat going as well, not FPL chat, but content creation chat, good man. Uh, right, back to the chat here then as well. Jared Burton, morning pal, let's address the elephant in the room. Are we, are we really okay without Foden? It's a tough one to take now on a, on Wednesday night with no Foden. All right, I was I was kicking myself after getting rid of him on the wild card, but Garnacho softened the blow and um, Garnacho um, got me back up in the ranks. But um, as I said, if, if we do get news, Foden is playing through the middle. De Bruyne is on the bench. I think I, I could be going for for Foden and for Saka, uh, just only because I'm on free hit. If you're on free hit, you can get Saka back in. Um, with Champions League round the corner, um, and the fact Saka wasn't in any training pictures. That could mean, um, that could mean a star from to be honest with you the way Arteta plays around, but we'll see. Yeah, and Moody saying the same. They're considering the Saka with the UCL games against Bayern coming in, not Brian. Bayern coming in, um, yeah, we'll we'll see closer to the deadline if we do get some news. But um, yeah, for now, Saka staying on my team. We might, we might, uh, we might make the switch, uh, for Foden just because I'm keep emphasizing and just because. I have the free hit left. That's that's why. Uh, captain at the moment is is Cole Palmer. Not a hundred percent locked in, but um, leaning towards Palmer at the moment. Uh, Sarabia, Sarabia, Burn or Smith, who to play? Uh, probably the attacker there. Sarabia Wolves could do well against West Ham. Leaky enough defence. No Ariola. You could argue is Fabianski better. He made a few decent saves against Spurs um, Wednesday night or Tuesday night even. Um, but yeah, I'd probably I'd probably play the Wolves attacker there. Will Saka play? Uh, at the moment, I think he will play. It's just if if we get news and Foden is playing through the center, I'll I'll be very very tempted to to bring him in. Um, so we we shall see on that good stuff. Um, right, good stuff. Forty five people watching. Appreciate you all tuning in bright and early this morning. If you are new to the channel, head on down there, hit subscribe. I really would appreciate it if you could at all. On the way to six k subs, trying to get there before the end of the season. And um, so if you're if you are watching and you're not subscribed, please do please do hit that subscribe button below and. Um, and support the channel i really much appreciate it putting the hours into the channel um as the members know what's going on behind the scenes but yeah um i really would appreciate it good stuff right rubber ducky another irish lad hope we're keeping well man uh who's my captain anderson Hallen salah or palmer i'm on palmer at the moment uh son is another shout there as well i probably rank it palmer salah son uh salah loves playing against united so um that's what i would say there here's the current shape up with my team i might as well start off with that so um that's how we are looking. Um, Garnacho, Udogi on the bench. We'll get a poll going later on. It's 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 a bit of a toss up between Gusto, Gabriel, Itnori, and Udogi. I have to bench one of them. I'm currently benching Udogi. Don't really want to bench Itnori when he's playing so high up for Wolves. Probably have to play an Arsenal lad because I need I need cover in Arsenal defence. And then Gusto and Petrovic because they're playing the worst team in the league. So that's why that's why I'm going there. Uh, Nick, what price do you think Foden will be next season? What's he now? Did he start off around eight eight point five. We'll have a look here. Um, as you can see there are two free transfers for myself so that's another reason why I'm probably looking at going for Foden if um, if he does start in through the centre was he 7.5 starting off yeah 7.5 maybe 9 maybe 9 next season 8.5 maybe 9 I think probably a million up is, is, is pretty fair the way the way he's been playing and he, he's getting a consistent run of starts anyway last year he was very annoying I had him in my team some weeks he was only starting when he did start he did well but yeah, and uh, no, we'll uh, we'll see. Ryan O'Mara, the man doesn't sleep. Give him a sub. Appreciate that, Ryan. Good man. Yeah, I had a late one last night. Up early again this morning. And uh, no coffee yet this morning, but a pint of water to get us through the next two hours. So, um, I'll I'll, I'll get a coffee after. And uh, right, good stuff. Moody, sack a bench this weekend, considering the midweek game against Brian. Yeah, Brian. Yeah, I think so as well. Potentially. Uh, Shane McEvitt there, Petrovic, Onana, Saliba, Gabriel, Bradley, the Cells, Gusto, Garnacho, Palmer, Son, Palmer, Sala, Saka, Gordon, Solanke, Hallan, Nunes. Who do I bench and who should I take in with two free transfers? No free hit, so no Spurs players, please. 
Right. Uh, Petrovic in goals, Saliba, Gabriel, and Gusto in your defence. Bench, Gab- Bench Lascelles and Bradley. Garnacho, Palmer, Salah, Saka, Gordon. It's probably between Solanke. Who did, who did Bournemouth have? Luton. No, you can't bench Solanke. Probably bench Garnacho there, Shane. He, he did well for us during the week, but it probably probably would bench Garnacho there. Yeah, that's what I would say. Um, who's after being a member there? Emokta, Emokta Jaber. Appreciate that, man. Welcome to the supporters here. Good man. Hope you're keeping well. Really appreciate that for the for the membership there. Um, good stuff. Right. Um, what else have we there in the chat? Also had Hallen captain and Saka vice Brundle fly. Jesus Christ. Oh, very unlucky with that. I saw some lad. Can I get that tweet up? Probably not. There's there's a, a few curse words on it. But he had, a, he had Areola in goals. And then Turner on the bench. And Turner got a yellow card. So Turner subbed in with a minus one. That pretty much sums up FPL, to be honest with you. And um, with that, then as well, crazy, crazy stuff. Uh, but Shane, yeah, probably, probably bench Garnacho there. If Saka, if we get new Saka or Foden is through the middle, probably um, Saka the Foden. Uh, but you've no free hits, so I think you have to keep Saka. Never mind that. Uh, Lascelles maybe to Van Heck to to build up a, a bench boost. If you have your wild card left, if you don't have your wild card left, um, do let us know there as well. Um, no, really surprised no one is considering Sal against Man United. True, I think it's just. I think it's just um, the Palmer hat trick. Um, before the game week, I, w- I would have went Sun before before um, before the games midweek. I was eyeing up Sun when I was when I was scheduling these captaincy videos, but I waited until Thursday Thursday evening. And then if you saw the conditions, I'll pr- play this once more. If you saw the conditions, I was out in Galway. And um, I won't say what pitch it is. I got a few messages about it, but the pitch was like that before I was even on it. Um, and if you saw my Instagram story. Got absolutely destroyed. Um, but yeah, good stuff. Um Brundle Fly as well. Cheers for tuning in, man. Captain Sack and our Captain Hallen and Sack advice. Very, very unlucky there. To be fair, you got you got away with it with, with, with Salah, only getting two points. So uh, on a different week it could have been could have been a different story. Ryan O'Marry's on his holidays. With Hallen being rested during the week, does that give him the best chance of ninety minutes compared to Sa- Salah, Son and Palmer? Probably, but I wouldn't be surprised to see him take being taken off early with the Champions League game then as well. Um Midweek, they're playing Tuesday night. I think so. If the game is over, Hallam will be taken off. He'd be wrapped up for for that uh, for that Champions League game. But um, yeah, still got seventy one points with half a team. There is a god Brundle flight great going there. Good stuff. Um, with the Real Madrid game midweek, I expect Hallam to be subbed after seventy. Yeah. Um, good stuff. FPL Andy is my favorite. Anderson. Hopefully, I'm your second favorite. So good man, Anderson. Cheers for tuning in. Um, right, Salah or Palmer, captain Niall. I'm on. I'm on Palmer at the moment. Salah's tempting. I'd rank it Palmer, Salah, son. Um, Salah got his rest. Um, probably kick up the backside from now. Would uh, wouldn't be taken off early. Um, too much. Too many chances missed. Um, against Brighton and then a very quiet game against Sheffield. So yeah. Um, wouldn't be surprised if he if he does. If he does very well uh, against United this weekend. Good stuff. Sixty one watching. Um, if you are watching me for the first time, hello. And <laughs> please head on down there. Click subscribe and support the channel. Shout out to the new member there as well for becoming a member on the channel. And um, if you want to do the same, head on down there. And um, there's a link in the description then as well. We're on five thousand six hundred twenty-eight. Really appreciate that. Seventy-two offer five point seven k gold before the end end of the stream. So a bit of work to do yet, but I really appreciate everyone who is new heading on down there, clicking subscribe. And um, yeah, uh, really really appreciate everyone and um, for doing that. Right. Back to the chat there. Um, where were we? Niall Bench and Saka for Madison. Probably would try and play the two, Niall. Surely you can play the two, let us know. Um, Abbas, on, on, I'm on Palmer. Uh, I don't have a free hit left for game me 34 and I've already wildcarded. I have two free transfers. Who should I bring in? I have Lascelles injured. If you don't have a free hit left for 34, you're going to have to build for 34 first. Um, so Everton lads, you could go Brandt with and um, if you haven't much money left, because with, with with that double gaming, eight Nori as well, but eight Nori probably be moved back to his left wing back position, and um, by the time that double gaming comes around, Bradley, I wouldn't probably go near Bradley. Trent will probably be back by then. Um, but um, yeah, go go for a defender who plays in a, in a, in thirty four because you're gonna have to build up to thirty seven then as well. Um, Munez for 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 Crystal Palace as well, decent double gaming for Crystal Palace. Two home games, West Ham and Newcastle. And uh, maybe Newcastle do get them. Maybe maybe West Ham uh, mightn't score um, away from home, but uh, it is not my ideal choice. Brandwit, Aiden Ori, but Aiden Ori won't be there. Um, come 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 that time around. But 
he's, he's a nice short term punt in, in Ori then as well uh, 100 teeth that's what I would say uh, Moody Gual would you consider bringing in Madison for Saka since you ha still have your free hit Madison doubles in 35 as well true that's actually not a bad shout there yeah um, I just prefer Foden with the Luton game if he does play that Luton game with, with Spurs having Newcastle then in 33 they do blank then as well I know but I can't get them out but 35 they do have the double in 37 then it's true I think Foden probably the better short term pick um, with with uh, Crystal Palace and Luton but that's not a bad shout there going for Madison then as well it saves me a transfer down the line then as well but I probably probably am probably would go Foden if, um, if I am getting rid of Saka not to say I am going to but we'll see and um, good man ryan as well you're up earlier yourself watch me ryan appreciate that hope the holidays are going well but right guys what's he saying good morning great content as usual dubravka or onana this week doubt either will keep a clean sheet but thinking onana might get more save points true who have newcastle uh, that's 34 who have newcastle 32 fulham i'll be tempted by dubravka fulham are very poor munez is 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 um Trying to shake off an ankle injury. He's been playing with an ankle injury the last couple of weeks, but he, he did get that bicycle against Sheffield a couple of weeks ago. If he had that um, ankle injury, then fair play to him for getting that goal. Uh, Onana will probably get more save points. Looking at clean sheet odds, Newcastle might be... Because uh, it's in Fulham, fair enough, but they were very poor midweek Fulham, um, if this wants to load at all. Uh, Newcastle are... Oh, surprisingly, okay, look very low. Fair enough. Going off the clean sheet odds there, maybe, maybe go, maybe go, um, maybe go Nana for for save points. Yeah, you're right, Salah. Salah could have another 12, 13 shots again. Um, yeah, I think I think Liverpool are gonna do. I don't gonna do. Um, get a few goals against us. Yeah. Um, Imact, talk about son of good shout. He is. I don't know. My gut's telling me to go for it. Captaincy. Um, I. It's a toss-up, really, between Son. Do we get the wheel out? Maybe we do. We're gonna see what the wheel says. Um, it, it's gonna, it's gonna be so close. Um, let's let's give this a, let's give this a go on yeah. Um, I'm on Palmer. Um, Salah, Son, Palmer. All right. Let's while this is while this is going, head on down there. Give the give the video a like. Give the stream a like. And if you aren't subbed already. Click subscribe for top quality FPL content like this. The wheel is going to agree with me on Palmer, and um, and the wheel doesn't lie. So maybe maybe go with Palmer then. So it is going to be very close, um, with with the captaincy. But yeah, um, Palmer the worst team in the league. Fair enough. He's he's uh, he's getting penalties, but three double digit hauls in his last three games is outrageous. He's he's kind of gone under the radar for captaincy anyway. Uh, maybe obviously not for, for having him in the team but for captaincy I haven't seen too many captain him in that Newcastle maybe a few captain him in the Burnley game but definitely not the United game um, yeah so I'm on Palmer could change before the deadline but um, for now I am I am I am leaving it on was that you Brundle Fly you didn't put up that tweet no it was it was all over it was all over Twitter got a couple of a couple of K likes on that uh, very funny I should have shared it to my Instagram story I'm not sure if that was you but um, yeah crazy Ariola, a lot of people have an Ariola Turner subbing in for minus one. That sums up FPL this season. Absolutely crazy. Um, Jono, Bench Carnacho, Saka or Munez. Considering considering um, Newcastle's clean sheet odds are so low, maybe Bench Carnacho, but he, he did very well for us during the week. But I can see Liverpool getting a few against us. We might we might get one, but uh, I think the fact that they, they turned around that game, McAllister got that scream of a goal, just that momentum coming into the United game. And us, us losing that, yeah. I think I think we're in a we're in bother. We're in bother this weekend. Uh, Abbas, hope you're keeping well. Abbas, did I miss your question? What did you say? Uh, who am I, captain? And Palmer, Palmer, Ron Palmer for now, yeah. Uh, by Gordon or Garnacho? Who have United over the next few? Thirty four onwards for United or thirty three onwards for United is very good. So maybe maybe go Gar um, Garnacho, um, but. Newcastle have actually pretty good fixtures from 34 onwards then as well. <sighs> Try and have the two for the wild card anyway. I'd have Garnacho or for the for the double game in 37. Garnacho and then um, I'd go I'd go Isaac as my as my um, preferred uh, Newcastle player is what I would say there. Um, right, good stuff. What else have we? Keep the questions coming in the chat then as well. I'm just going to throw this up on uh, on Twitter then as well. If anyone wants their team teams rated. Uh, we'll throw it underneath this 
on the on my Twitter account and we'll get the we'll get the teams going. Um written. What's Palmer? Forty seven percent on the captaincy poll. Teams. All right, good stuff. And then emoji. Do let us know you're doubling up on, on Chelsea defence as well. I, I think I have, you have I think if you have them you have to with, with that uh with that Sheffield United fixture, right? That's that tweet gone out there. If anyone wants their teams rated for the weekend, send it in under that tweet and it will get you up on stream here then as well. Michael O'Connor in the chat as well, another member of the channel. Hope you're keeping well, Michael. Um, how's things? Um, right, back to the chat there then as well. Foden, will he play today? I can't see why he won't. Um, we, we should get City new team news before the deadline then as well, so um, stay tuned for that then as well. Niall could play the two, but taking a chance on Morris over Saka. Not mad on Morris. I had him for the double game. Like he, he was very, uh, he was very, um, very quiet over the double game. Like I brought him in over Haaland. The risk should have paid off. How I'm blank, obviously against Liverpool and Arsenal. I had, had that blank game week before before game week twenty nine, and Morris. I don't know what happened to him. He uh, he couldn't convert at all over over the over the double game week. So very very disappointing. Um, right. What are we saying? Two hours to go until the deadline. Um, so keep the questions coming in. We're, we've uh, we've a lot in chat here. Fifty one, um, and as I said, give the, give the stream a like. And if you are watching and you're not subscribed, please do hit that subscribe button below. We're seventy subs off hitting our five thousand seven hundred goal. I would really appreciate it. If you are new, you're watching me for the first time. Please head on down there, click subscribe and support the channel. Help me on my way to, to getting that as well. What's Michael saying? Send you my team on Twitter, Niall. Good stuff. Great to see you, Michael, and, and all all the other members in the chat. Jack, we saw William, um. Who else had we weed? Uh, Imak Dogba as well. Right, Michael, what, what's the chat? What are you saying on chat? Uh, you're in Dublin. A little tired this morning. Uh, am I okay this week in your opinions? Any changes or captaincy shout? Salah captain, first off. Um, could be could be a great differential shout this week. Uh, the Bravk over Ariola is perfect. It's, it's fine because um, Ariola won't play. Udagi, Doughty, maybe you do have to play him against Bournemouth in that fixture. Um would you be tempted to do the double up on Spurs? Maybe. Maybe. Um, what else have you there? Foden, Son. Look, you've got that lovely Foden Hall. Fair play. Uh, Palmer, Sackett, Salah midfield. Darwin and Tony up front. Haaland might hurt you this morning, Michael. But um, the team is fine. Would you play Pedro Poro over Doughty? Spurs third favour for a clean sheet. Luton are 15% chance for a clean sheet. So maybe, maybe I would play Pedro Poro. Over Doughty, but I can see why you're playing them, spreading the risk. Spurs have, have been a bit leaky in the fence lately. Um, team is looking good though. Salah captain, are you locked in on that? Let us know. Um, stay tuned as well for Saka if I do get rid of Saka. Um, I'm going to emphasize this: if you have your free hit left, you should probably be tempted to get rid of Saka. Um, if Foden is playing in the centre to, to early or later or later on this morning, and um, when, when we do get some City team news, but. Yeah, that's team is fine, Michael. If you want free transfer, save it. But um, let's see the news on Saka. Who are you missing there? Oh, you've no Garnacho. That's all okay, fair, good stuff. Um, right. Any news on City? Not yet, but I think we will get some before the deadline. Brundle fly. Uh, so so stay tuned for that. Um, I think we will get it. Right, we've got a few teams in there. Let let that build up for uh, another minute or so, and we'll get back to the chat here then as well. Um. Ford will you play? I think so, yeah. But stay tuned for the leaks. Would you would you go no Halland to get there when in Isaac Son, Saka, Salah, Saliba, Gabriel? Would you go no Halland to get in there when Isaac, Salah, Son? If that's on your way, you can afford. Fair enough. And um, you probably can go against Halland, but um, I wouldn't be surprised to see Halland doing well this morning. Newcastle can't keep a clean sheet to save their lives. Plus defenders injured. True. And the Barafka should have probably saved that penalty. It was a poor penalty from Calvert Lewin. Uh, are you worried about Saka? I'm tempted to get Foden in. If you're on, if you're on, if you have your free hit left in 34, you probably should be tempted to um, to go for that. Yeah. Um, Saka out, Michael. Not yet, but depending on City team news. If if Foden's playing and the Bruyne is benched, I'll be I'll be tempted to to go Foden in. Um, as I said, I'm going to emphasize Foden. What or if Saka wasn't wasn't seen in in uh, any training pictures, so that's why I'm tempted. Um, Newcastle, yeah. Ian, are you worried about Saka? Tempted to get Foden in. Yeah, we'll see closer. Son or Foden for the armband, Jason? Probably Son if you're looking for the armband. Um, 
As a United fan, I'm scared for this weekend. As an FPL player, I'm considering bringing in Diaz to join Salah midfield. Nothing wrong with Diaz. I'm I'm, I'm eyeing him up for the for the double gaming myself when I, when I will be on free hit. Um, hopefully Jada doesn't come back in that time. He's very close to return Jada, but it could be looking at Diaz, Salah, Darwin, or Diaz, Salah, and um, and Trent Alexander Arnold if Trent is back. We'll see. Um, Right, Max Verstappen, hope we're keeping well. I'm new to football. What league should I watch and what club is good enough to support? I'm confused between many teams. I'm liking every team I watch. Uh, thanks for stopping, Max, Max Verstappen. Um, of the, uh, between many teams, I'm liking every team I watch. If you're an FPL manager, don't support a team. Uh, there's no loyalties in FPL, but um, I, I, it's, it's, it's a tough life as a United fan at the moment, so maybe stay away from them, Max. Um, Jason, quite tempted to take in Foden and place a son since Spurs blank on game week 34. If you have a plan to get Son back in after, that that's fine. Um, but uh, I would I would uh, make sure you have a plan to get him back in, Jason. Um, Sterling there, Norman. What's Michael saying? I've sacked in Foden. I'm not set on any captain yet. Fair. I'm on Palmer. Palmer is going to be very high percentage effective ownership. Um, but hopefully um, he does return well. Um it's very close. It's a lot closer than it seems. Uh, Twitter's all all Palmer, um, but I do I do think it's going to be very very tight on points wise between the between the captaincy. Looking up uh, expected or predicted points, P- Palmer is on ten. I think yeah ten. Son is next with seven six. Haaland six eight. Salah six six. I think it's going to be a lot closer than that. Um, if if Haaland does start, I think he he, sh- he could easily get two this morning. Uh, William, I'm surprised not to see Jota versus Sheffield United. He's been he's been training over the last week or so. Yeah, he's just coming back at the wrong time. Ahead of that double game, he couldn't when we're going to be using our free hits, William. And um, hopefully he's a uh, he's not sniffing around there because he could take D as a spot. He could k- take Noon as a spot as well. So and uh, that could favor non free hitters then as well if we take a punt on on Diaz and Jada um, steals the line. Or if Jada's back in the form right before the double game, if he plays that Crystal Palace game in thirty three, I think it's thirty three. Is it? Yeah. He could be a nice show for the double gaming then as well. A nice differential haul or a nice differential punt then as well. Brian in the chat as well. I hope you're keeping well, Brian. A lot of members tuning in this morning then as well. Appreciate you all lads tuning in. What are we on here now? Um, 31 likes on the stream as well. If we can get close to 35, I would really would appreciate that in the next couple of minutes or so. If you are watching and you're not so subscribed as well, I'm keep gonna, gonna be reminding you all about this over, over the next two hours or so. I really would appreciate it if you can subscribe to the channel. I'm trying to get to 5,700 subs before the end of the stream. A lot to do there, probably very ambitious, but um, yeah, I really would appreciate it if you could at all s- to subscribe to the channel. Um, what's Breen saying? What do you think of Saka's chances to start? I think it's 70-30 starting, to be honest with you. Uh, the, the fact he hasn't been in any training picks doesn't mean much, um, because it's happened a lot a lot of times before when he hasn't been training, and Arteta just starts him anyway, because he's, he's, Ars- he's Arsenal's, if one of, the, one of the best, if not Arsenal's best player, so. But Champions League round the corner might, might um, might sway Arteta's decisions if 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 Saka gets injured right before that um, Bayern Munich game. Uh, so yeah, there's a lot of things to get in there. Um, Michael, there. If we get Saka news that he's not starting, who'd you bring in on your team? Who have you there now, Michael? Let's get you back up there. Um, Michael's team here. So you've you've Foden already. You've Son already. You've Salah. Saka, you you could probably go Odegaard if you, if you if you have let me know if you've a free hit Michael left sorry at the so many players <laughs> or managers that messaged me I can't I can't remember everyone's uh everyone's ship strategy but um Saka Saka to Odegaard could be a shout um you already have Foden Garnacho um you, you you don't really want him against Liverpool this week uh who would be a nice punt if you're if you are free hitting in a uh, in thirty four. Madison, I suppose, then as well. Yeah, we're chatting about Madison. For or you already have three Spurs. Um, back to this. Gordon, but he's a he's a bit of a boring pick, really. If you well, if you don't have Isaac, Gordon could be a shout maybe for Newcastle cover. Um, yeah, that's tough there, Michael. Maybe Odegaard. Let us know your trip strategy though. Um, but maybe Odegaard if you if you aren't free hitting. I can't remember your your trip strategy there. Right. Back to this then. We have a few teams here. Let it will uh free hit and wildcard and bench boost Michael, yeah. So oh you've wildcard as well. Jesus. Um so maybe you could take a few short term punts. Um 
Hmm. Maybe on another city lad, depending on the on the lineup, but there's they're not really. It's only really Ford, and you won't be able to get the Bruyne. Uh, maybe Odegaard, so Michael. We'll, we'll we'll see the. It's just because you already have Ford, and uh, we'll see closer to the deadline though. Um, but yeah, maybe maybe Odegaard. Uh, what 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 am I thinking about Saka's chances of starting? Seventy thirty there, Brian. Yeah, Brundle fl fly ten Hag in or out. It's tough. The team is is pretty pretty poor at the moment. Um, Rashford, if you saw that clip of him running around there, it's. It's it's very sad to see. I really I really like Rashford, but this season he's um his head isn't at it. Um, I don't know what he's doing. He's probably trying to get Ten Hag sacked. Um, something not clicking between the two of them there then as well. And Ten Hag has to play him or has to bring him on at least. Um, uh, but just when he was floating around there then as well, not good to see at all. Um, yeah, not good. Would you go? Would you start Ganacho over Moon as there? Josh Sims. Not the crystal or not the Coventry striker there, Josh Sims. No, um, is his first name Josh? Um, maybe Munez. Just the fact that that Newcastle clean sheet percentages is so low, um, is what I would say there. And uh, what else is there? Jason, no bother at all. Would you start Ganacho over Munez? Same question again. Probably would start Munez there, just with the clean sheet percentage there. Uh, start Douglas Louise or Darwin Nunes. Thank you, Darwin Nunes. I, I think. Uh, I think it's going to be pretty, pretty, um, pretty high scoring for Liverpool. They could get two or three on on Sunday, um, and Nunes should be, should be involved then as well. Good stuff. Keep the questions coming in if you can at all. Ten past nine. We've an hour and forty nine minutes to go until the deadline, um. So lot, lot, um, lots to discuss yet then as well. Uh, let's see these teams. So we'll 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 get them up on stream. So if anyone is watching them, wants their teams rated, uh, Thomas Ober, keep them well. Another member, Thomas in the chat. Jesus, the wind out there would blow the knickers off and none. If you can't hear it on the mic, apologies. Uh, but it is pretty loud around me. Um, do let us know if you can't hear it on stream. Or apologies. Not appreciated. Apologies if you can't hear it or it's coming up on the mic. Um, Havertz is flying under the radar. Think of getting him in next week. What do you reckon about Havertz FPL era? Nothing wrong with Havertz. Uh, I'm eyeing him up myself on the free hit. Definitely getting Odegaard. Could be... It's going to be Saka, Gabriel, maybe Odegaard then as well. Um, I probably prefer Odegaard over over Havertz, but Havertz could be a lovely differential. We'll get the Arsenal lads up here. Um, Odegaard, what, what uh, 17% and Havertz is 4.2%, so it could be a lovely differential. He got his assist against Luton then as well. Those two double-digit hauls against Sheffield and Newcastle are lovely there as well. Only one blank in his last two, four, five, six games. Only one blank in his last six, which is pretty interesting. He definitely is going under the radar there, Thomas. Definitely is. Let's have a look at Odegaard. He did get his goal during the week. Havertz could be a nice point on, on the free hit, so maybe a lot of a lot of managers won't have him. So with my rank at the moment, 83k, I probably need a probably need um a few more differentials, especially on my free hit and bench boost. Um Havertz could be a shout there. I think it's Saka, Gabriel, and one of Havertz or Odegaard, and maybe go all all attack on um, on Arsenal. Do they keep a clean sheet against Chelsea? Maybe not. And would you, you try and hedge your bets and then not keep a clean sheet against Wolves? Maybe, maybe. Um, yeah, we'll see. I probably got rid of the Arsenal double defence at the wrong time. Two clean sheets in their last two, and um, but it did mean I could bring in Garnacho, Isaac on the wild card. Uh, and it Nori, so maybe it maybe it uh, it evens it itself out there. We'll see. Um, yeah, but Thomas, yeah, Havertz is not a bad shout at all. Four four percent owned at the moment could be a very nice punt on the on the free hit. We'll see. We'll see closer to that week there. But um, yeah, not looking not looking too bad. And uh, thanks for tuning in as always, man. Really appreciate it. Uh, Mike, all good. Weather is cat and kill there. Yeah, it's very very bad here. It's my girlfriend's birthday party today now, and there's all bunting outside, blowing all over the place, just looking out the window here. So she'll be hoping it clears up later on, but uh, hopefully it does. Fingers crossed it does. But um, we'll, we won't think it. We're not in party mode yet. We're, we'll uh, have to get this stream out of the way first. Good stuff. Right. Um, right, we're going to get into these uh, teams on Twitter then as well. 5,632, so 68 off hitting 5,700. So if you are watching and you're not subscribed, please do hit that subscribe button below. Uh, trying to, as it keeps saying, trying to hit 5,700 before the end of the stream. 
Uh, so I'd really appreciate it. If you're watching me for the first time, if you aren't subbed already, head on down there, click subscribe and support the channel. Steve McMahon, hope you're keeping well, man. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm doing good. Hope you are, I hope you are the same then as well. Bradley or Cher alongside double Arsenal back at defence. Probably Bradley for more chance of an attack and return. He might be looking to to get um, to make his wrong make his wrong the right after getting the own goal against Sheffield. But maybe maybe Bradley probably the more chance of, of an attack and return between those two. And um, it's what I would say there. Uh, Palmer fifty four percent. Salah twenty two percent. One hundred and three votes on the on the captaincy poll. Um, Haaland nine percent. Surprisingly, Haaland very low. Could be a great differential pick for the. For the airman this week if you do want to go differential um as i said differential on active teams um right good stuff no we don't want to go premium on twitter right let's get this let's get these teams up on stream here and uh, get these ready keep the questions coming in the chat if, if you can at all anything anything you want to chat about um obviously we didn't re we didn't we didn't uh start off with the double, double gaming news as well then double gaming for chelsea and spurs in 30 in 35 Going to be another one in 37 for the two then as well. So with my wildcard, I'm well stocked up. Slightly worried about Sanchez coming back in into the team. Petrovic has probably been a bit dodgy over the last few weeks. So Sanchez is back in training. I wonder, is, is it Petrovic's spot to lose? Will he give him another game game or two? Hopefully he does. Um, but that could be um, the upper hand to wildcarders in 35 if Petrovic is placed, uh, goes under with, with Sanchez coming back into the team. We'll see. But uh, for now, I've probably the three best players for, for Chelsea. Petrovic, Gusto and Palmer. Son and Udagi, I'll probably be looking at bringing in Madison um, for that double game week then as well. 35 and then they'll have the double game week in 37 then as well. So we'll see how we do get on there. But I uh, forgot to mention that double game week um, in 35 for, for Chelsea. Palmer captain is going to be the obvious pick there as well, as we all know. Who is it? Aston Villa and Spurs. Okay, fair. Could be, could be some nice returns there for Palmer, especially from the spot then as well. Right, let's get these teams up on stream here. Hopefully this isn't anything dodgy. Sterling, yeah, good stuff. Okay, that's a betting thing. We won't go into that. Right, Slim. Any advice, dude? Have bench boost and triple captain left to use also. He's, he's gone Salah captain. Watkins is touch and go. To be honest, I'd nearly move on Watkins if you have him. Um, but Bernie at home, if, if he does start that Bernie game, you might be you might be all right there. Martinez in goals, he should be he's touching goal as well. But you have Debravk on the bench anyway. Pedro Poor, Gabriel Gusto, nothing wrong with that back line. Saka, Salah, Son, Bowen, no, no Foden or no Palmer is a big one there. I'd, I'd nearly go Gordon to Palmer and, and play him over over Watkins. It, maybe even Alvarez is, isn't guaranteed to start either. So, yeah, not 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 the most ideal situation there. But um. Bench boost and triple captain left to use. Save it for 34 for Salah. Um, but yeah, I think you definitely need Palmer there. Slim. If you're in the chat, Slim, get get a, get Palmer and you, you definitely, definitely need him. Uh, here's Sterling here. If you're in the chat, Sterling, hope you're keeping well. Uh, can't see your goalkeeper, but Gabrielle at Nori Brantwit. Nothing wrong with that. Would you start your doggy over Brantwit? Maybe, maybe not. Everything are pretty high up for the chance of a clean sheet. Cunha could be a nice pick as well. Solanke and, and Haaland all grand up there up front. Saka, Salah, Palmer, Son. Nothing wrong with that team at all. Maybe maybe Udagi over, over Brantwood, but, but Everton, as I said, are high up in, in the on the clean sheet. I, I'm curious to know who your who your keeper is if you've got Ryan on the bench. But uh, nothing wrong with that team. Fair play. Um, have we got another team here? We do Saqib. Thoughts? One free transfer and 3.1 in the bank. Captain not set. Foden for Saka if we get early team news. Yeah, I'm thinking so. Hopefully you are watching Saqib. I hope you're keeping well. You, you do tune into a lot of the streams. Leno and goals. Virgil, Udagi, Gusto, Hugo on the bench. Kiwi or Regulon. That's fine with those back three. Then Palmer, Saka, Salah, Son, Kudos, Darwin and Isaac. Nothing wrong with Darwin and Isaac up front. Haaland might hurt you um, if, he does, if he does get the start, which I think he will. Um, you have Palmer. Nothing wrong. Keepers Pickford there back to Sterling. Apologies, yeah. Nothing wrong with going Pickford then in goals over Raya with, with that home fixture. Um, right, back to Saqib then. Palmer, Saka, Salah, Son and Kudos. Kudos is it could be a decent differential. I'll be hoping uh, West Ham stay quiet with my uh, Nori um, in the fence. Uh, Nori could get an attack and return as we do know then as well like he did during the week. Uh, best differential for this week is going to be at Nori, yeah, especially if he is playing in that left wing role. Could have had two during the week. Um, I spoke about him a lot in the video last week and this week. 
if you're if you have if you have two free transfers to use and you have a transfer to burn, take a take a punt on Aitnori is what I'm gonna say. Definitely, definitely do that. Um back to the key pair, one free transfer three, but one of the bank, captain not set. Um move it off, sack a vice captain and just in case anything does happen to Salah, but I think he will be fine. It should be he definitely will be fine. Um let's see. Um Saka in for Foden or Foden in for Saka only only if, if you are if you're on your free hit in thirty four. But as I said, wait till closer on until the deadline and we should get some team news, hopefully. Um good stuff. Keep the keep the questions coming in the chat then as well. Is there anything we can we can get up maybe if we get up FPL team and show you my transfer plan for the next few weeks then as well. Um right, this is how I'm currently lining out. Get get Haaland into the team there for Garnacho, Udagi moves to the bench for Saka, and then Petrovic in for Kelleher then. So two free transfers to use. I have to make a transfer this week. Don't forget that, Niall. I'm actually going to set a, a reminder on my phone because knowing me, the deadline will be getting... Uh, yeah, I'm just setting a, an, an alarm on my phone because I could nearly forget I have two free transfers. But I have two free transfers to use. Uh, so have to make sure I do use one or that'll be a waste of a transfer. But um, options this week is either Lascelles, Savan Heck or Saka out for Foden, depending, as I said, on the leaks. Um, yeah. Team then next week, if if we do Saka to Foden, if he does start that looting game, that would be delightful as well if I do bring in uh, Foden. Um, team then would be Newcastle could play Bournemouth. Uh, no, Garnacho would probably be on the bench then again. Goose team is looking well for next week. Then again, could nearly play. I uh, probably would play Crystal Palace. The Kelleher and goals against Crystal Crystal Palace. Uh, Bolu, did I get to your team? Did you put it under the tweet? Or if not, maybe you're, you could be on private. But I I did go to everything. Um, let us know, Bolu. But I I've been to every one. I'm nearly sure. Oh, here we go. Sorry, apologies. Down below. Here we go. Here's Bolu, here we go. Any improvements? Uh, you have two free transfers. First off, Solanke, Hallen, Moon is up top. That's all good there. Foden, Salah, Saka, Palmer, Son. You already have um, Foden, so uh, so that's all right. You have two free transfers to use. You're going to go Gabriel, Udagi, and Gusto, I'm assuming, in defence then as well. If if Foden, or if it seems like Saka is going to be fine, if the word that if the word around Twitter and that is that Saka is going to be grand, I would... Uh, I would just do Lascelles to Van Heck for a bench boost in um, in thirty seven, and that will that will give an extra player. You're you're pretty much burning a free transfer, but you're building up towards that bench boost in thirty seven, and you're not wasting a transfer then as well. Uh, but Petrovic, Gusto, Udogi, Gabriel, Foden, Saka, Salah, Palmer, Son, probably Hala- Solanke and Haaland up front. So you're probably benching Munez there, and um, but yeah, confused why bench boost thirty four and free hit thirty seven isn't the best choice, Sterling. Just because with my team at the moment, um, I have triple Chelsea, double Spurs. First off, double Spurs have a blank in in thirty four, and Chelsea have Arsenal in thirty four. So I'll be looking to take out all my Chelsea players on my free hit, taking out all my Spurs lads with that blank, and that's why that's why um free hit is very popular in in thirty four because you can take out the Spurs lads and then having them for the double game week in a uh, in thirty and thirty five then as well. Same with Chelsea. I'll be taking out all those Chelsea players against Arsenal. Don't want them in my free hit. I want to stock up on double gaming players. Um, I suppose when we look at the free hit team there, um, but even then Garnacho has a nice single gaming fixture then as well. Um, but that's the reason why people are, are free hitting 30, 34 and bench boosting in 37. Just get rid of the Spurs lads, but have them back in then again for, for the double gaming. Same with the Chelsea lads. Get them out for the Arsenal game. And we'll still have them then for for the double game week then the week after. That's that's the that's the main reason. Uh, Garnacho or Saka or Fafana start one. Taslima probably probably uh, Saka out of those for now, but let's see if we do get anything before the deadline on Saka. Thirty five likes in the stream. Really appreciate that. How's the sub count? We'll have a quick look. Quick reminder. I'm gonna annoy you all if you are watching and you're not subscribed. Head on down there, click subscribe. We're five thousand six hundred and thirty three. So sixty seven off hitting 5,700 the goal before the end of the stream or if we can get close to that at all 
I would really appreciate it. If, even if you have a burner account or anything, log into that, click subscribe, and help me help me on my way to get there. Really, really would appreciate it. And thanks everyone, as I said, for tuning in this morning. Um, bright and early, I really do appreciate you all tuning in. Uh, Bolu, if that's all right, though, back to your team there. Um, just for sales to Van Heck, if um, if you don't need any any other transfers, and then you're you're um you're building yourself up for the bench boost in thirty seven. Let me know if you have your bench boost left, Bolu. But um, that's what I would say. Um, Sterling, but but that double for Spurs and Chelsea are so bad, and the doubles for thirty seven are worse than for thirty four. True, but everyone loves a double game. That's why that's why everyone is going for that. Um, yeah, that's what I would say. Um, true, but everyone loves it. Loves a double game. Chelsea could do could do well. Aston Villa at home and and Spurs. That could be a lot of goals in the, in that Chelsea Spurs fixture, like there was earlier on the season. Very very enjoyable game to watch. I don't know if you remember that Sun could have had a haul there, but even when Spurs were down to to, to ten men or nine men, was it four one in the end or what was that? Um, did he get a return? That I remember watching that in, in the pub and goal, and it was one of the best one of the best games of the season no he blanked that week 4-1 though and um, so wouldn't be surprised to see high numbers in that Chelsea Chelsea Spurs game you can look at that United game two two bad teams Spurs are good but they're not great at defending so it could be could be a lot of goals in those games for sure um, Jan over keeping well Havertz and Gabriel are Saka and Lascelles have two free transfers and want to get rid of Lascelles primarily but don't have enough money just to sell them for anyone figured Saka to Havertz isn't that bad True. I wonder will Havertz get a rest though. Um, he's been playing a lot lately. Uh, um, from what I, from what I heard during the week, no, no, he played sixty five, so he might be all right. Um, but I heard Smith Rowe had a good game. Did he play? I think he did during the week. Yeah, he got an assist. Hard to know on Havertz. Um, it's 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 not the best. Come back to that Havertz differential between Smith Rowe performing well, but. If Havertz was playing up front, I think he was. Did Jesus get on at all? No. So Havertz is definitely the favourite at the moment. Nothing wrong with going Havertz, but wait until close to the deadline if we if we do get some Saka, some Saka news. That's what I would say. Um, CR seven LM ten. Hope we're keeping well, man. In the chat. Uh, Sterling confused. Yeah, with with the current chips to keep. Free hit thirty four, wild card thirty five, bench boost thirty seven, triple captain better in thirty three or thirty six. It's better in thirty four. Or no, so you're free hitting into the old crap, yeah. Um, geez, you've a lot of lot of chips left to keep, right? Let's have a look. So free hit in thirty three or thirty six. Could be the Luton game there if we get news. This could be Salah. Could be a Man City player there. What's in thirty six? Man City against Wolves, Arsenal against Bournemouth, um, probably that Luton game if we do get news about Haaland or that, um, that Luton game are probably the best shout for, for your free hit, um, that's what I would say there, yeah, pity you don't have for the double game week, but I understand why, I understand why you're, you're, you're wanting to use other chips in the other game weeks for the double game week, so nothing wrong with that, that's all fine. Um, Lascelles for Van Heck for game week 37 for bench boost. Good shout, cheers. What do you think, Saka for Odegaard and Bradley for Zinchenko? Maybe hold off on Saka if you don't have your free hit. If you, if you don't have your free hit left, keep Saka. Bolu, let me know what chips you have, or maybe you did say it already. Um, yeah, let us know what chips you have, Bolu, but if you don't have your free hit left, you have to keep Saka because you want it for the double game week then. Um, only with me, I'm only considering getting rid of Saka because I have my free hit left. Um yeah, so I can I can get Saka back in on my free hit. Uh, people definitely love a double for sure. Yeah, Bradley for Zinchenko. Key was 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 put back to the bench. Zinchenko came back into the team. How many minutes did he play? Seventy three, three bonus points as well for Zinchenko. Didn't realize that. Um, so he must have had a good game. Um, Bradley for Zinchenko. Gabriel and Saliba are, are are my top top picks for for Arsenal defense definitely. Um, that's what I would say, but. If you if you if you can't stretch to Gabriel or Saliba, maybe it has to be Zinchenko then. Uh, maybe maybe that's what I would say. Yeah. Um, right, we're still live. Anyway, hopefully the Wi-Fi isn't isn't gone. I think we're we're all good there. Or maybe we're not. The phone is frozen. I think we're still going. Yeah, never mind. We are still going. Let us know. 
my phone is frozen here but I think we are okay yeah we're all good good stuff heart heart and mouth moment there I thought we lost everyone but we're, we're still we're still good we're still all good um, Alexieri Gusto Brandwit and Bradley bench one please probably Bradley out of those um, Gusto and Brandwit are pretty high up for the transfer clean sheet this, this weekend um, what else have we there no free hit but got my bench boost Good woman, Sophie. Still all good. Good stuff, right? Uh, Solanke or Morris to start. Francesco has to be. Has to be Solanke. Yeah, Morris is, is very poor. Um, I wouldn't. Wouldn't. Uh, wouldn't be going that. Wouldn't be going near Morris. Um, Solanke definitely with that. Uh, who are they playing the favourite enough fixture? With that Luton fixture, I wouldn't be surprised to see Bournemouth get a few goals. One at least, anyway. I'll be hoping it won't be Solanke, but we we shall see. We shall see on that. Good stuff. And um, we have a few notifications on Twitter. Maybe we've got a few more teams, um, and we have. Yeah, good stuff. We'll we'll get them up on stream. We'll just give this a retweet again. Um, good stuff. Keep the questions coming in. What are we? An hour and a half to go until the deadline. Hoping to get some. Uh, we should get some city team news before the deadline. Um, but do do send in your questions, and we'll keep you entertained as much as I can. Right back to these teams before. Saqib, we got Saqib there, Slim, we sent you an old screenshot, right, let's, let's get Slim's team up then again. Um, Kelleher over Dubravka, maybe, maybe United, United, uh, what's William saying there, wonder will the Luton Bournemouth be a goal fest again, could easily, I'll be hoping it isn't, um, Solanke could be a, a big threat to my rank, so hopefully hopefully he doesn't, um, but I wouldn't be surprised to see to see a few goals in that game, I sure completely forgot, it wasn't, wasn't so long ago, it was right, yeah, over that double gaming, so easily could be. Um, yeah, just hopefully Solanke has a relatively quiet game. Will we'll be typical for Solanke to get a to get a hat trick when when everyone isn't captain of them against Luton. Um, I've seen stranger things happen in FPL. Uh, but yeah, um, Gabriel Udagi Gusto here for Slim. All good there. Eight Nori on the bench. I don't think I don't like that Slim. I'd, I'd go eight Nori over over Udagi. He's playing left wing. Fair enough. Udagi was getting high up against against West Ham during the week, but Spurs. Are slightly risky in the fence. Just get it, Nori in there. What he what he's playing left wing. If you're if you're benching a defender who plays left wing, no, I wouldn't. I would definitely not rec recommend that slim. So get get it, Nori into the team there for sure. Uh, Palmer, Salah, Son, Saka, template midfield, all good there. Uh, Darwin, Hallen, and Isaac. Pretty much the same team as mine. Only the keeper, eight Nori over over a doggy, and then I think we've pretty much the same team. Yeah. Um, yeah, I wouldn't wouldn't be going wouldn't be going for that. Go um go eight Nori in the team definitely, is what I would say. Um Right, how are we looking there? We are still all going well. Connection looks good, cool. Um uh, right, Slim, get eight Nori in the team. Let me know if you you've subbed them in. Definitely, definitely get them in. Uh right, we have a few more teams here. What's uh no free hit left, okay. So if you know free hit left, you can't sell Saka this week. Um Lascelles, you don't have enough for Van Heck does anything either. You've Raya, he's taken up all your kind of budget there. Um hmm. That's tough because you, you you can't you've only four million to get for a defender, and I don't think you, anyone who doubles in thirty seven um has that. So Van Heck four one. Pity, pity about that now. Taylor three nine, but you don't want him in at all. That's a pity, um, Jan. If Jan is watching this, uh, Gusto eight Nori Udagi this week is fine. Salah, Saka, Son, Palmer, Garnacho, Darwin, Solanke, Halland. I don't know how you're even going to burn a transfer there. To be honest with you, um, if you do Petrovic, if you, but then you want Petrovic for the double game week. If you downgrade Raya to another keeper, who's who's going to bench boost in a in? But you've no free hit, so you want Raya for that. That's a pity. To be honest, at that team, you're, I think you're just going to have to lose your transfer there, Jan. Um, it's not very ideal, but you can't do anything. Lascelles to Taylor to have some a playing player, maybe, but at that price, then you can't do you can't do much more. If you had an extra point one of a million, you could get Van Heck in for your bench boost, but unfortunately, you can't. So you, it's going to be very it's a it's a very very boring transfer. If if you thought Lascelles to Van Heck was a boring transfer, Lascelles to Taylor is even worse. But just because Taylor plays, and you'll have an extra player playing on your bench for your bench boost, then but it's a pity you can't get the Van Heck there. That's what I would say. If you go sack it to Foden either, but you don't have your free hit left, so no, I wouldn't say that. But yeah, Lascelles in for Taylor. Or Taylor in for Lascelles just because he plays and at that price point. But 
just because you can't get 0.1 extra that's a pity that's a big pity there and um, unfortunate about that Jan Philip Crowley another one there Ben 10 and um, good stuff Petrovic Udagi Gusto Saliba Salah Son Palmer Saka Isaac Hallen Solanke all looking well there Philip Philly all good to go I think Sal Palmer captain then as well Jeez, the wind is going outside and um, all good there all good there Isaac hopefully he gets another return Solanke could, could do well for you this week then as well and um, let's see if we get news on Saka let's let's uh let's see um good stuff Ben 10 then again any tips thoughts on Foden captaincy let's see if 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 De Bruyne is playing maybe wouldn't go Foden captain um but Pau Doughty Gabriel De Bravka nothing wrong with that defense Tony on the bench you can see why because because you're um you've got Pau in in defense Palmer Salah Saka son Isaac and Solanke Hallen no Hallen probably hurt you to be honest with you um, but yeah, I would probably leave it at that. Wouldn't probably play Semedo. He, he's more chance of getting a yellow card than a return. Hopefully, Wolves get their clean sheet, but it might be might be tough. West Ham are, are in decent scoring form, maybe not decent defensive form, but they they should should get a goal. Hopefully, they won't. But how how are Wolves actually for the chance for clean sheet? Um, let's see here. Once this wants to load, maybe it doesn't want to load. Here we go. Yeah. Um. Wolves, twenty seven percent. So two, four, six, eight, nine, top nine. Okay, fair enough. That's what I would say. Hopefully they do get something. I don't think they will with the clean sheet, but just have to hope it in order to get something. Uh, Ben ten thoughts on Foden captaincy. As I said, if if uh if the Bruyne is playing, maybe 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 don't bother. Um, I'll leave it on leave it on Palmer. He's on penalties then as well. So that's what I would say. That's all good there. Um. 5,636, so appreciate all the new subs there. We're 64, 64 away from uh, from hitting our 5,700k. 5,700 goal before the end of the stream. If you, are, if you are watching and you're not subscribed, please do. 64 subs away, come on. How many have we in the chat there? Um, 27 in the chat. If you're watching for the first time and you're not subscribed, head on down there. Or if you have even a burner account, head on down. Head on over to that, click subscribe, and help me try and hit that before the end of the stream. Right, back to the chat here then as well. Should I transfer Sack out for Foden and still have my free hit, Nathan? Let's see, yeah. Um, I'm tempted to myself. Um, let's see if we do get news on Foden um, starting. It's time to take risks, to be honest, and especially if we do have our free hit. Maybe maybe we should do. We're, I'm going to be going, looking to have Foden in the team later on in the season anyway, so maybe maybe I'll just bite the bullet and go for it then. Um, looking at my double gaming, so let's say if I do bring in Foden, 34 doesn't matter I can uh, I can bench boost then 35 I want Madison how can I get Madison in 1.2 million in the bank if I get rid of Darwin after maybe if I get rid of Darwin before Crystal Palace maybe not to save have a bit of money but then I want Garnacho. it's tough to fit them all in unless I do a loop de dupe and go <laughs> forward into Madison but I don't uh, I don't think if I go forward in this week it's going to be hard to get Madison in for the double game and I want I want three from each especially without everyone who's wild card and, um, but at least with my free hit I, I can get Saka back in so that's not the worst option there um, and can, can get Sun out that week then as well we'll see I'm glad I kept my free hit. Looking at that, I'm very glad I did keep my free hit. Um, yeah, I am. Right. Anyway, back to back to gaming thirty two. That's another couple of weeks away. Anyway, and um, that's how we're currently lining up. It's Palmer, Palmer captain. Or as well go go back to this. Um, but I have two free transfers, so I'm gonna have to use one this week. I need to, I need to see how we do get on. Um. If you have your free hit, Nathan, we'll see. Close to the deadline, let's see. Um, but I am tempted to go to go for Foden and for Saka. But Saka could easily do well tonight if he does start. 50, 55, I was going to say 50 to 60% owned, yeah. 56 percent pretty much owned. Could either either go go great or bite bite us. and uh, come back to bite us. Um Foden is what? 35 percent owned. Yeah. We'll see. Um, it all depends on the news before the deadline. 
Right, 20 to 10. Let's keep this going. Um, really appreciate the help, Slim. No bother at all. That's why I'm here to help you. Good man. Uh, CR7, LN10. Can you rate my team? Onana, Gusto. Onana, Gusto. Brantwood, Aid Nori, good man for having Aid Nori. Saka, Palmer, Sun Captain, Isaac, Solanke, Watkins, Debravka, Sal on the bench, get him into the team. Get him in over Watkins, maybe. Uh, don't be benching Salah. Don't be benching Salah, CR, CR7, LN10. Maybe you're a Man United fan, maybe that's why, but I would not be benching, benching Salah. Um, Watkins is, is touch and go, they said, for, for the Burnley game. If he starts, he'll do well, but I wonder, will, will they try and rush him back in before that? Maybe they will, but... Salah has to be in the team there. Um, Onana over Dubravka, fair enough, probably for save points there, but definitely, definitely wouldn't wouldn't be benching uh, Saka, definitely not. Uh, Keller hurt or Dubravka this week? Probably Keller. I think Liverpool have, have definitely higher percent chance of a clean sheet. 9% more of a chance of keeping a clean sheet, so maybe, maybe, uh, maybe go Keller, yeah. Might get a few save points Keller then as well, especially with, with, with it being in Old Trafford. Um, but uh, yeah, uh, going with Hallen captain for this week, Ian, nothing wrong with that, provided we get early info, Hallen has differential captain too tempting, that's, I was thinking about that myself, Ian, I won't lie, um, so there's absolutely nothing wrong with that, to be honest with you, I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I wouldn't say no to that, no, um, but the only thing is, I do think he might be subbed off early, if they're, if they're up by two or three, um, because if he gets injured before that uh, Madrid game during the week, yeah, um, we'll see. Yeah, but Hallett differential captain, absolutely nothing wrong with that. I was thinking of myself. Probably rank it Palmer, Salah. Oh, it's very close for, for two. Salah, Holland, Son. Yeah, it's, it's a differential, but as I said, we've only seven game weeks to go. Um, but we'll see. Uh, Michael Farrell, hope you're keeping well, Michael. Two transfers, need to use one. Worth getting rid of Ariola to double game with keeper or do it with Alex Moreno. Um Depends if it's a double game and keeper for 34. Probably look towards Pickford um, or Henderson, Crystal Palace keeper. Maybe Pickford has probably the better better double game week. West Ham and Newcastle for Palace. Can probably see the two teams scoring there. Everton might get a clean sheet against Forrest at home and they even have Liverpool. So could be a lot of save points for Pickford. So if you're looking for a double game and keeper for 34, I'd, I'd, go with, uh, I'd go with Pickford is what I would say there. Um, or do I do it with Alex Moreno? Are you getting rid of Alex Moreno, is it? Um, is Dinya back in or is Moreno playing a bit more consistently? No, he's not. Maybe you get rid of Moreno then. Eight Nori, I'm, I'm going to say that name again. Eight Nori, if you have two free transfers, a short term punt on Eight Nori, nothing, nothing wrong with that at all. Um, that's what I would say. Um, really, really like, um, really like Eight Nori. Um, paid off for me during the week um, let's see if we can at all 5,637 appreciate the new sub there then as well 63 away from 5,700 uh, it might pick up in the last hour or so but when there's a few people panicking but we've uh, we've a job on before the end of the stream if you are watching and you're not subscribed please do please do hit that subscribe button below we'll try and get close to 5,700 if we can at all I really would appreciate your help Um right what else have we then um Mundit, just go from Saka to madison makes more sense true but foden does have luton next week um and forest and newcastle short term foden i prefer to have the points on the board if i was going to sack it out foden um crystal palace city could easily score a few i was um How's the clean sheets for Palace looking? I'd, I'd, I'd say they're very, very minimum. Um, yeah, no no clean sheet since 26. So that's why that's I'll be looking towards Foden first over, over Madison for short-term gains. Get the points on the board if you can. But I, I get what you mean. Why I should be looking at, a, at a Madison if I want him down the line then as well. Um, Adam, what percentage key or start do you think? I think Zinchenko is probably more favoured to start. Um, I'd say 60-40 Zinchenko in favour of Zinchenko, to be honest with you. Um, 
yeah, that's what I would say there on, on that. Uh, William, what are you saying? Considering Semenyo for Munez when I'm playing with that injury thoughts. No, I think... Fair enough, Semenyo did, did, did pretty... Pretty well in that in that Luton game. I was at 14, 13 point haul, was it? We'll get him up here, but I think leave it leave it uh, leave Moon as into the team. I think uh, the Fulham manager said uh, the Fulham manager said he should be fine. Uh, just getting up warmer here then as well. What was it a fifteen pointer against Luton, was it? Thirteen and fifteen, yeah. Two for the Sheffield United game. Thirteen point against Luton. Fair enough, nothing wrong with that true but I'd probably leave I wouldn't bother wasting a free transfer going some menu in I know he's a double game then as well which is true um, but yeah 47 likes as well in the chat appreciate you all for dropping the stream of like this morning if we can get the 50 at all I'd uh, I'd really appreciate that just seeing here if we are still live I think we are yeah all good um, do I play FPL challenge we'll get into my challenge team I haven't even looked at it yet to be honest with you um, and we'll get into that then. Any possibility key war, as I said, 60-40 in favour of Zinchenko, I would say. Should I take out Sack and replace with Odegaard Craig? If you have your free hit, you can probably take a punt this week. If if not, you'd want Sack on your free hit, so I wouldn't I wouldn't be going away from Sack. It definitely not. Um Ian, what are you saying? Early sub is a good point. Currently 140k overall. Great rank with man, good stuff. So need to do something a little different. Hopefully a hungry Hallam today. Very true. Uh, the only thing about Holland, if he does blank in the, in the early kickoff, it's a long, it's a long week, especially with Sun, Salah, Palmer. All on, Sunday's going to be a long day if uh, if Holland blanks. But I do think Holland gets something. Um, I, to be honest, if you if you played if you played that against Aston Villa and scored, you'd be you'd be looking to captain him this week. So it's weird how things work. It's just. Recency bias, I think Palmer. That's why everyone is going on, but he's in is in great form. Palmer, two, three double digit holes in his last three, uh, forty eight points for Palmer in his last three games. You, it, it all points towards Palmer for the Ironman. Um, but yeah, uh, one hundred and forty k, William or Ian, Ian. Sorry, there's nothing nothing wrong with uh with going with going Haaland. Yeah, could be it could be a nice differential to get you inside the top ten k or top one hundred k if uh if Haaland if Haaland goes off this morning. Alex here, sorry for repeating the network is so bad in my place. Saka or Munez, Kelleher, Dubravka. Thanks, Governor. No bother. Kelleher over Dubravka, I would say. And then I'd start Saka. But if we do get news before the deadline, you can always sub in Munez. But I'd go, I'd go, um, I'd go Saka. I'd go Saka for now, yeah. Let's see. Let's see if we do get news before the deadline. I'll, I'm going to keep an eye on my phone here. Thanks for hitting 51 likes on the stream as well. A great return this morning. Really appreciate that, everyone. Um, Right, FPL challenge. Anyone playing it? Anything else we can we can put in here? Uh, yeah, we're going to get a poll here. I've made my mind up pretty much, but Palmer there, fifty two percent. Anyone who's joining in late while I'm while we're on the captaincy poll, one last look of this of this uh, of this captaincy video I went out Thursday night. The absolute state of this pitch in in Galway. I, I'm going to emphasize if anyone is watching from the club, it was like this before we were on it. But horrible, horrible weather and horrible. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not going to be harsh, but the training pitch was was very bad. We we were in and out pretty much getting it done. And uh, but yeah, right. Palmer, fifty two percent, one hundred and ninety votes on that. Uh, going to end that poll there. And um, let's get another poll up straight away. Then um, for my own team, uh, I'm pretty. I'm pretty pretty much certain. Or happy enough with a. Uh, with who I'm benching, but I just want to see what the chat thinks then as well. Um, and who's my last defender? Do, 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 do. Who is my last defender? Udagi, Aitnori, Gabriel. Ah, jeez, I can't even remember my last defender. Gusto. Oh, yeah, Gusto. There we go. Uh, do let us know if you are playing challenge. What's Michael or what's William saying there? Very poorly. Let's have a look at challenge quickly and then we'll get straight back into we'll get straight back into um into our team there. Red rivalry, players from Manchester United and Liverpool get double points. Right. Great team, so what other content creators are out there in that weather? Serious effort. Appreciate that, William. Good man. Uh, had to get it done and appreciate to the two lads, Mark and, and Nathan, for, for helping me during the week. Uh two good friends of mine that they didn't have to at all but um 
and Naden and Goals was diving around. Uh, you can see him in the video there. He's he's um he's all muck. So shout out to those lads. Right, um, probably have to go triple, if not quadruple Liverpool here in this challenge game. Uh, Luis Diaz. I'm probably going to leave Garnacho in there, seeing as they get double points just for appearances. That's already two. Um, Garnacho. Um, what else have we then? Just making a quick team here for for the double or for the. I'm not really enjoying this game. I won't lie. So I'm going to be I'm going to be quick on this. Um, it's it's not enjoyable. Uh, Isaac will go. Isaac and fifty four million. Isaac and who's a decent. It was a decent fixture this week. I'll get up on the phone here. Um, I suppose Hallen maybe. Yeah. Uh, right. Let's get this done quick. And get back to the game we only care about. Um, Palmer, of course, Palmer has to be in there. Palmer, and then defenders. I'm going for my boy, Eight Nori. Eight Nori, uh, what budget have we left? 29, so six into 29. Five million, have to keep that around, so. Well, it's fine on the bench. We can go to Sells, Taylor. Sells. Don't like the way. You can't fucking change that. Um, right, who, who could be a good one? Gusto, maybe. Sheffield United. Transfer in and then doesn't want to transfer in Gusto for some reason. Good stuff, lovely. There we go. And then who else? Maybe go Brantwit. He's cheap. Right, defender then. Bradley will stick him on the bench. Can always play him if I need to. The cells. Right, we're getting straight back into FPL then. Hopefully we haven't lost too many with this with this game. Let me know if you are enjoying it. I'm not really enjoying it. It's um it's it's not great to be honest with you, the game. Um twelve point eight, we've plenty of money left then. Um Onan on the bench maybe. Doesn't even even really matter who we go. Um I'll probably go Virgil. No, I need a midfielder. Just stick a lang in there, it doesn't really matter. Um seven point seven for a keeper. Pickford will throw Pickford on the bench. That's it. Not mad on that game, yeah. Very boring, Alexia. Yeah, I'm just gonna get this done quickly and then forget about it. Then just of the off chance we we get the trip to New York, but yeah, I'm not enjoying that at all. Save that team, Salah captain. Back to my school. I didn't even bother making a league for for my Instagram or or um or Twitter. I, I'm not enjoying it. It's it's a, it's nearly a, a slog making a team every week. Um, hopefully I haven't bored you there for. For too much. Alright, back to FBL and straight back to the chat there then as well. How are we looking here? Um good stuff. We're sixty away, five thousand six hundred and forty. Sixty off hitting uh, our five thousand seven hundred gold. So really appreciate it, everyone who has subbed to the channel. Um can we get there before the end of the end of the stream? Let's see. Right. Back to this. Uh, I'm glad to see the chat is agreeing with me here. Udagi, 60% for bench. Yeah, that's who I'm currently benching, so I'm glad to see that then as well. Shout out Ashley in the chat there. Is Saka out? Not confirmed. He hasn't trained. He hasn't trained. Um, did we get the Arsenal pictures up? Um, Arsenal. But he, was, he wasn't in any of the training pictures um, is the only thing. 
uh, that we get this up here. We can flick through it here. No sign of no sign of Saka at all is the only thing. Maybe there was more, was there? Some of the best photos. Um yeah, he wasn't pictured in training and it was there was a full a full booklet of um of pictures with Saka. Saka wasn't pictured, so let's see. Let's see um before the deadline. If we get forward in news, I'll be tempted. I'll be tempted to go for him. Um Right, we have a few notifications. What's going on here? Uh, Paulie, let's get Paulie up here. Saka and the cells of Foden and Verdi all getting ready for game week thirty seven. If you're looking for game week thirty seven, it wouldn't go Verdi all. Ake could be back by then, so maybe maybe leave off Verdi all. He's he's a decent short term punt, but no. Uh, Saka, if your free hit left, you do so that's all right. Saka to Foden could be could be a shout with your free hit left, uh, Paulie, but maybe not Verdi all. Um, could take a punt on Eight Nori. My boy at Nori, and um, but I wouldn't go very all just with with Ake coming back. We don't know how long he's out for, but uh, he could he could be back sooner rather than later. Not not a, not sure on the actual extent extent of his injury or how long he's going to be out for, but uh, we'll see on that. Good stuff, right? Um, an hour and two minutes to go until the deadline. We're into the business period now. Um, keep the questions coming. Ashley is Saka out? He's not, but uh, let's see. Let's see if um. We do get news before the deadline. Um, can you rate my FPL challenge team? CR7, LM, let's go. Pickford, all good there. Conser, Romero, Doughty, Sterling, Foden, Fernandez, Garnacho. You're definitely, you're definitely a United, United fan. Um, you need, you need some Liverpool lads in there. CR7, uh, LM10. I think you need, you need a, you definitely need Liverpool lads in there. That's what I would say. Maybe come back with it with a few more Liverpool lads and, and let us know. But um, nothing wrong with going, going with your team. Chewy, would you sell Madison for Foden? On free hit, 34 bench boost, 37 no wild card. Maybe. I probably would, you know, yeah. Um just with, with Foden, you get the Crystal Palace game and and the and the Luton game next week. Considering Foden does start that, I think he I think he will. Um but there's nothing wrong with that at all. Um you probably want Madison back in for their doubles, but um, you can probably get Madison in, in another way then as well. Um, good stuff. Uh, everyone's saying the challenge is a bit boring. All right. Um, Chewy, FPL Chewy. Hope you're keeping well, man. Uh, thanks for tuning in as always. Would you sell Madison for Foden? Uh, sorry, I, I did. I did answer your question there. <laughs> uh, read it twice. Yeah. What are you saying then? Yeah, I don't like it. Next week's challenge is dreadful. I don't even. I'm not even going to bother going looking what next week's challenge is. Um, mooted FPL challenge seems dull. They're just trying to get people to quit after a month or so back into FPL. Yeah, it's it's not the it's not the game for me, especially with no competitiveness to it. Um, ruin the game. It'd be fun if they could create chat box inside the mini league. Maybe. Um, I haven't even really looked into it much, but yeah, it's not my massively cup of tea to be honest with you. Um. But yeah, uh, Fede Lascelles replacement long term gonna free hit in game thirty four. What's your budget, Fede? Do let us know. Um, long term Van Heck for four point one million. It's probably the probably the shout there. Um, four point one million. You could go Brandt Wade either around that price point four point three. He's got a double in, in thirty four. Uh, Van Heck has it as the double in thirty seven. Um, so it's either Van Heck or, or Brandt Wade. Take your pick, and um, if if you're free hitting thirty four, Van Hecken gave me thirty seven, so you can you can bench boost in. That's what I would say. But all good on that. Right, keep we'll keep the questions going if you can at all. Um, Lascelles replacement. That's what I would say. Four point four in the bank. Yeah, um, but Van Heck, Van Heck four point one. If you're bench boosting thirty seven, or if you've no free hitting thirty four. Oh, you're free hitting. Sorry, in thirty four, probably Van Heck. So Van Heck, get him in for your. For your bench boost, um, is what I would say. Um, looking at my team, then, do I do the forward and move for Saka? Maybe, 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 maybe. Garnacho up against Liverpool. The United score against Liverpool. Maybe. Um, hmm, decisions to be made. An hour to go until the deadline. Uh, but Fede four point four. If you get free hitting thirty four, forget about Brantwood. Go with um go with Van Heck 4.1 million and that'll set you up for your bench boost in um, in game week 37 good stuff um, 59 subs away from 5,700 um, an hour to go we need a sub a minute at that rate to, 
to get to get our goal. Really appreciate it. Anyone is watching me, 46 in the chat. If you are watching and you're not subscribed, head on down there, just click subscribe. Um, I'd really appreciate it. Um, we're putting serious work into the channel. Big push on now for the end of the season, trying to hit 6K. But first off, if we hit um, 5.7K before the end of the stream, I'd really appreciate it. Um, good stuff. Young Lawler, would you sell Saka for Foden from minus four? Free hitting bench boost, free hitting 34 bench boost and 37. Don't think it's worth a hit maybe because of Saka. For, definitely for free. Well, not definitely, but I'd, I'd probably lean towards it if it was for free because there's every chance Foden outscores Saka by, um, by a few, maybe not four, but if... Um, I wouldn't. I probably wouldn't do it for a hit. No, we'll see. We'll see in about thirty minutes time. We should get some city news, but I try, try and not, not for a hit. I don't think it's worth it for a hit. Now to be honest with you, um, but yeah, no, maybe not. Um, no bother for you there. Thanks, man. All good. William, what are you saying? Lewis Hall and Rico Lewis. Any value in having them with their teams being hit with injuries? Um. Any value, Lewis Hall, he did pick up all three bonus points before he went off, but Rico Lewis, don't know when Ake is back, I'm going to see when Ake is back, when Walker's back then as well, it it, it completely phases out, but fair enough, unknown ham, or unknown return date, um, Ake as well, they probably don't know, yeah, calf injury, he just said they were out for this weekend, um, Pep, so... It, Looking at thirty seven for the Man City double, uh, they'll probably, they'll probably be um, they'll probably be back by then, yeah. So that probably, that probably, if, if er, exterminates. I'm trying to <laughs> get the right word out there, but takes out your any any hope of getting um Rico Lewis into the team there because you you want players who will be playing for your bench boost and um, Lewis Hall. Where was he playing? Um, Newcastle he had a good game was he was he left back around there but uh, 4.2 he did get 9 points he came off before they did concede uh, I just think there's too many injuries there for Newcastle I wouldn't be wouldn't be going near them um, no Isaac is the only boy you want for Newcastle maybe Gordon then as well but I wouldn't be mad on, on the double up there definitely wouldn't uh, Fede any differential this game week um, this boy Aiden Ori. 6.1% playing left wing need to say any, any more about him um, let's see anything else here um, 6.1% should have got two goals against uh, Burnley uh, missed a one on one uh, he's a great differential this week and it won't last for long just because um, just because um, Wang will be coming back into the team so I wouldn't be wouldn't be going near that uh, any other differential Hall was left back, okay, fair. Uh, any other differential? Let's have a look. Gibbs White, 1.9% off the back of a goal and an assist. Vardy All could be a shout in defence then as well, but I, I prefer Aiden Nori. Um, I would go with that, Aiden Nori. Let's, let, let's say that. Um, good stuff. Right, back to the chat here then as well. Udagi bench in there that, that's all all fair on that uh, but yeah Fed 8 nor he'd probably be me top differential this week um, 8, 2, 10 and then a 12 point of the week before so um, really hoping he, he can get something against West Ham West Ham and Forest over the next few probably could get rid of him on the free hit maybe with Arsenal and he'd probably be playing um, a bit more defensively um, with Wang back into the team but let's see let's see how we get on uh, Brundlefly nothing on City yet no Um should get something in, in the next half hour or so. Um but we'll see. We'll see on that. Um what else are we saying? Last hour into the deadline, when do you think we'll get City News? Maybe in the next half hour or so. Want to go sack at the Foden but can't trust the early kick off Philly. True. I already have Haaland. I think City get a few anyhow. Um but then they might be all subbed off early with, with the Madrid game. Um if if things are wrapped up earlier on, um, if it's two three nil at half time, Haaland Foden could easily be subbed off at half time. Um, that's another thing then as well. But I'd probably be around the sixty minutes. But we'll see. Um, Rizwan just sent you my team on Twitter account page. Good stuff. We'll we'll get to that. Rizwan, good man. So many away to Luton or Tony away to Villa. I play I play Tony. He's on penalties. Um, yeah, right. Let's get into the few teams that haven't sent in. So. Rizwan, hopefully we can see your team because normally you're on private. 
Um, for some reason I can't. Let us know which tweet you put it under, Rizwan, but I can only see two teams here at the moment. I can't see your team. I think it's something to do with your privacy settings or something, but if you want to just even chat it, um, chat it in, in the comments below, Rizwan, and, and we will get to it. We, we're always having this, this these issues with you. For some reason, I, I can't see your, your teams, but um, appreciate the extra sub there as well. 58 away from, from hitting 5,700 before the stream. Uh, job on, but... Um, if you are watching and you're not subscribed, please do uh, hit that subscribe button below. Um, Jack, it's team sent in. We'll get straight to you now, Jack. Good man. We'll we'll, we'll prioritize you first, Jack, because you are you are the member um, of the channel. Anyone who wants to become a member, head on down there into the description. You can become a member for the price of less than a pint a month. Um, and yeah, Jack here, he's, he's a member himself. So let's get straight into his team. Went gross to Palmer, one free transfer. Nothing wrong with that at all. Dubravka. At least he didn't get Turner subbed in. Dubravka, Pedro Poro, Gabriele, Nori. Good man, you're gone for eight, Nori. Uh, lovely little haul for us last week on that. Hopefully he can get something again. Uh, Saka, Son, Palmer, Captain, Salah, Garnacho, Solanke and Haaland. Haaland and Solanke, both good shouts up front. And then Saka, Son, Palmer, Salah, Garnacho. I don't think it's worth taking a hit for Saka. So I think you're I think you're all good there. Um, Palmer, Captain, nothing wrong with that then as well. Uh, Rizwan Sinis account isn't private. I don't know why we, we can't see your team. It only comes up sometimes, so Rizwan. Um, I'm just having a look through here. If we can't see your team at all. Paul Beats, we'll get to Paul in a sec. Slim, Slim. Maybe it's down here, is it? Sterling. Ronan, we miss Ronan. And that's just a betting thing, right? Ronan, Udagi or Brantwood. Apologies, Ronan, we miss your one here. Petrovic and Golds, all good. Gusto, Udagi, Nori. Probably would play with Doggy over Brantwick just to add a ch chance of an attack and return. I'll, t I'll hope he, he stays quiet, but Sun Saka, Palmer, Captain, Salah, Haaland, Solanke, Muniz. Ronan, if you're still here, all good there. I think uh, I think you are good to go. Uh, Palmer, Captain, yeah, I think I think you are fine there. Good stuff. Right back up to, to Beats here. We've got a few more notifications. Who's up here at the top? Kieran has just sent in his team there. We'll get you up on screen, Kieran. No bother at all. And... Um, Joe, send in, your, send in your team in chat there. Yeah, no bother at all. We will get to you. Right, Paul Beats. Hopefully Beats is in the chat. Um, a few new people I'm seeing in the chats below. If you are watching and you're not subscribed, please do uh, hit that subscribe button below. We're 57 now away from hitting 5,700 before the end of the stream. So listen, send it to your mother, send it to your father, send it to your brother, send it to your sister, send it to your girlfriend. Just uh, if you can at all, click subscribe. We've uh, we've 57 to get in the next uh in the next 53 minutes or so, I'd really appreciate it if we if we could get there before the end of the stream. It was up early starting this stream, so um, hopefully we can get there. Right, Paul, two free transfers. Hopefully you are watching for this. Dubravka in goals, that's all fine. Gusto, Gabriel, maybe you need a defensive transfer. Mm, or maybe not. You could go Zavarni. That's all right, so maybe. Um, Palmer, Saka, Salasun, Garnacho, Tony, Solanke, and Haaland. You're probably benching one of Garnacho or Tony. Maybe Garnacho, maybe play Tony. So you probably can do with a defensive transfer there, Paul. Uh, I'll be tempted by it, Nori. Kibura to it, Nori. Play him over as a Barney. Um, if if uh, if Luton get one, um, he's in the chat there, Paul. Good man. We'll be tempted by it, Nori. Seeing it as the fact that you do have two free transfers, or just wait, maybe until if we do get Saka news, um, or if we do get Foden news, if he's if he's playing through the through the center, uh, if either going to be Saka to Foden, I'd I'd recommend uh P Paul there, or Kibura to. Kibura to Eight Nori. Um, let's see. Just a short term punt on Eight Nori left wing. He, he should have had two goals last week. Easily could have uh, could have another haul today. Hopefully, hopefully he does. We'll see. Right. If that's all right, beats do let us know. And um, we'll get to Rizwan's first there. Um, or sorry, Andrew Peters. Come on, Andrew in the chat there. Would you consider Captain and Munez as a differential? No, I don't think so. Fair enough. Newcastle are pretty pretty poor in defence, but just the fact that Son, Salah, Palmer. Haaland, all those could easily do well. I wouldn't trust my fate in, in Munez. And especially, I know he's been doing well, but especially he's nursing a, a, an ankle injury at the moment. Uh, but as you are, are saying there, Newcastle are, are full of injuries as well, but I don't think so. Um, if it was, no, no, no. I'm not going to even say, uh, sorry, Andrew, no. Salah, Son, Palmer, Haaland could easily all do well this week. I wouldn't I wouldn't uh, rank Munez in around those, but... As I said, Newcastle are full of injuries, but no, I wouldn't. I wouldn't go near that at all. No, no. Um. Right. What else have we there then? Um. 
where was Rizvan there? Raya, Raya et Nori, good man, you've Nori, Van, Van Dyke, Saliba, Palmer, Foden, Salah, Garnacho, Holland, Isaac, Munez. Who's the captain on it? Uh, Rizvan, let us know. Transfer made, Foden in for Saka, free transfer, and Ednorian in for Doughty. Ednorian is no bother at all. Um, let us know your captain is Ednor- or, um, Rizvan there, but nothing wrong with that team. I think you're, you're good to go. Jack awful wind out in mead as well yeah shocking out here very very bad and um, kieran we have you up here now and a chance i could get some tips on my team i have two free transfers and just trying to bring in some good double gaming players because i'm planning the bench boost 34 sent sent my team on and a cheeky little x good man kieran right here we go so your bench boost in 34 you probably have to do a, a goalkeeper transfer and uh, but i'd wait leave off the goalkeeper transfer for now cause, because if allison isn't back until then you could uh you could get Kelleher in for Ariola, but we'll see what the story is with Allison in two weeks' time. Um Right, thirty four. Um so we'll be looking at Everton lads, you already have no you don't. Maybe Brandt weighed in this week for for rest opinion. Mm, eight Nori maybe. You could take a punt on eight Nori this week, have him for the double game we try and maybe maybe we'll do that S opinion to eight Nori, then go eight Nori, Gusto and Dowdy in the fence, but um, looking at the double game weeks in 34 who else is a good shout for a bench boost you kind of have to sort out the dead wood so as the opinion isn't guaranteed of a start Wang could be back by then so that's alright Solanke has a double game week that's alright um, you probably have to get rid of, of, of Gusto I'll, I'll try and save the bench boost for 37 Kieran to be honest with you just with the with the Chelsea lads, they're playing Arsenal. I wouldn't be mad of Ben boost, Ben bench boosting them against Arsenal. So maybe maybe hold it for thirty seven. Maybe that's not what you want to hear, Karen. But it probably would probably would say that there. Um, yeah, I'd probably I'd probably save it for for thirty seven. Just leave a few issues there with the bench boost. Doubt he wouldn't want to be bench boosting him. Um, who do they have in thirty thirty four? Brentford, mm, not the worst, not the worst fixture, but. I'd I'd wait for I'd wait for uh, thirty seven is what I would say um good stuff right um what are we fifty not forty eight minutes forty eight minutes to go into the deadline right we should be getting city team news sooner rather than later uh Swabir Kar Karoma um how are we getting on what do you think any changes Ryan goals Gabriel all good there get it Nori into the team I'd even play him over Gusto to be honest with you. Um, or maybe even over Gabriel have to have to be playing Aynori while he's playing up front or while playing up up high for for Wolves there so get him into the team there uh, Swab definitely 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 get get Aynori into the team um, no I, I wouldn't be mentioning him definitely not no when, he, when he's playing that high up um, how are we looking there good stuff yeah, get in or into the team. Salah captain, that's fine. Nothing wrong with that. Um, you have a bit of a bench and headache then as well with uh with Tony on the bench, eight Nori as well. But uh, as I'm saying, get it Nori in there. Um, yeah, get it Nori in. Uh, could you play Tony maybe over Saka, but maybe not. Um, but team isn't bad there. That you're just get get it Nori in. I'd, just get him in. He's he's playing left wing. <laughs> get him in. Get him in. All right, good stuff. Um, Rob, come on, Rob, in the chat. Are you in there, Rob? Uh, what's Beats in first? I've not used my wildcard at bench boost yet. When's the best time to use them now? Wildcard thirty five uh, beats and set yourself up for the double game week ten and thirty seven and then bench boost then. That's what I would say. And um, is there many doublers? I think there's six or six teams doubling. Um, I'll call you out to the. I've got a list here of uh, of teams Dublin. Let's uh, sorry now messages are flying in on the Patreon. Everyone's panicking. Um, teams Dublin in thirty seven. Chelsea, Spurs, Man City, Brighton, Newcastle United. They're the, they're the teams Dublin in thirty seven. Um, Eddie, take out Lascelles and put eight Nori in. Yeah, I would do that. Um, that's what I would say there, yeah. Um, Beats, Isaac. What, go back to your team here. What were, you, what were you asking on Isaac? 
Isaac in for Tony. Maybe. Maybe in for Isaac in for Tony. That could be another shout. But let's see. Let's see if we get Foden news. Um, Tony to Isaac or, or Saka to, to Foden. Let's see. Let's see the news we get before the deadline. That's what I would say. Um, yeah, that's what I would say. I've missed a few here then as well. Um, do, 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 do. Start your doggy or Fort Munez. Probably start the attacker there, yeah. Joe, Ravka, Kelleher, Brantwit, Gabriel, Udogi, Eight, Nori, Van Heck, Salah, Son, Foden, Palmer, Odegaard, Halland, Darwin, Semenyo, Bench and Semenyo, Halland, Darwin up front, 3 5 2, Udogi, Eight, Nori, Gabriel, or Brantwit over Udogi, maybe. That's what I would do. Uh, right, Karen, back to you, so, because you're still confused. Um, you have your wild card, did you say? You have your. What chips have you left, Kieran? Let us know. What are you saying there? Back up to you. Uh, Plan the bench boost gave me thirty four. I wouldn't. I wouldn't bench boost thirty four. No. Going back to what what we were saying. No. Um. Because you've you've Huang mightn't be back at all. Wouldn't want to be bench boosting. Est opinion. Kerkes who mightn't even start the two games. Um. So I'd save it for thirty seven. Oh, you you've played your wild card already. Um. I just use free transfers up until thirty seven. You've you've enough time. To, to build to build a, a, a decent bench boost get two two doublers you probably could and have them on the bench boost um yeah i think 34 is probably too soon and i wouldn't want to be mentioned doughty s opinion kirk is those lads on the bench boost definitely not no and especially with chelsea playing arsenal so save your save your bench boost for later on the season karen is what i would say but um if that's all right do let us know tinker bell love that Lo absolutely love that just after getting the I'm up on screen here. That is class. That is lovely. Love that. That is class. Uh, up on up on the screen. Should have got a, should have got a fresh fade for to be on the t on the TV there. But really appreciate that. That is class. Love to see that. Uh, right back to Rob's team here. One free transfer. One point nine million in the bank. And um, let's get us back up here. Absolutely love to see that. Um, that deserves a follow back. Whoever that is. Uh, FC Tinkerbell. Hopefully I'm following the mama. No, I'm not. That definitely deserves a follow. Natasha, good woman. Really appreciate that. Um, right, Rob. One free transfer, 1.9 million in the bank. No city, no Arsenal. Free hit, 34. Bench boost, 37. Uh, Neto, Pedro Poro, Gusto, Zabarni. Nothing wrong with the defence there. Maybe double double up on the Bournemouth lads. Might might pay off, but seeing as it's, it's a Luton, Luton um, might sneak one. Uh, Salah captain, nothing wrong with Salah captain to be fair. Uh, no Foden is the only thing. Yeah, no City. You can't get the Haaland. Team is fine. Team is fine, Rob. There to be honest, with you. you could probably roll the free transfer. Um, yeah, no Saka, no Arsenal, no no uh, no City. That's the only thing there. Uh, beats there would be wild to sell Haaland. Yes, yes, it would. Yes, it definitely would. Would not. Would not sell Haaland. Uh, beats definitely not. Um. No, do not do that. Definitely not. Um, you could easily do well this morning. Uh, five thousand six hundred and forty-four subs, fifty-six away. Uh, we might pick up now once we get some city team news. But um, can only take get it get it Nori if I take Saka out for Foden, Eddie. Um, point five short of getting it Nori for the cells. Okay, we're back to where you er, take the cells out and put it Nori in. Let's see. Let's see. Um, let's see the the city news before the deadline. I wouldn't. I wouldn't. Um, I wouldn't take it for a hit. To be honest with you, um, right. Eddie's in the chat here. Sorry, Eddie. Good man. I'm looking at your at your team here now. Do not. Do not take out. Um, Hal, no, that's beats anyway. Uh, right, Eddie. We've got your team on on a on my phone here. Goose, Gabriella, doggy. That's all good. Um. You can save for now. Yeah, right, Eddie, just got back to there on Patreon, good man. Um, right, back to here then. How's things, MKTV? Hope we're keeping well, man. Sell him mooded so I can captain him. I'm going to sell. He'll just go score in five. Uh, 
call here on the Patreon. What else are we saying there? Isaac is a captain. Nothing wrong with that, Rizwan. Um, Eddie, are you all sort of there? Can only get to it, nor if I do. Yeah. Lovely stuff. Right. Um. Is it worth it essential to use my two free transfers to get in it? Nori can't do the sell, say it, Nori Tarek. What's the rest of your team there, Tarek? You're in the Patreon as well. If you want to send it to me, we'll get it we'll get it up on my phone here. Right, Patreon is going mad at the moment. Foden benched. What? Fantasy football. Let's see that now. Where are we seeing that? Foden doesn't start. Don't know if I believe that yet now. Oh yeah, he does not start. Jesus. There we go. Phil Foden does not start. There we go. Well, I won't be doing that move, so <laughs> there we go. Um, right, Foden not starting. There we go. Um, Yeah. All right, Foden not starting. Let's get back to the chat straight away. Um, very interesting. I won't be doing that move. So, um, so that just makes my transfer this week very, very boring. Um, it means. Right, Eddie, back to you. Sorry, now let's get back to you. Um. Getting back to now on Patreon, Eddie. Um, give off. Uh, I'd just roll. Right, uh, Eddie, let me know if, you, if that's all right for you. I'll get back to you on my phone then as well, good man. Uh, shout out to JD if, if JD is in the chat there just got a new Patreon member uh, shout out to JD if you are in the chat there good man um, let's get you right into the group chat before let's see if we can get you in before the deadline Right, we'll get back to the Patreon messages. What should I do, right, Michael, now that uh, Foden is benched? Let's get Michael's team back up now. Right, so Foden is benched. Hmm. How much have you in the bank, Michael? How much have you in the bank? Um, do, 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 do. If you could go Ake to eight, eight Nori and play him over Foden or... If you could do Morris to someone up front, let us know. 
um let me know what what uh, how much you have in the, in, in the bank but there um there do let us know um right while well, michael's getting back to on that let's uh right eddie you've got two free transfers um you already have van heck Jeez, yeah, that's tough because would you do downgrade Dubravka? No, but Dubravka for the rest of the season because um, Pope is out for the rest of the season, so that's all right. Um, all right, looking at Mike or looking at Eddie's team here then as well. <sighs> okay, you've only what did you say? You've only point one in the bank. Right, Eddie, let me know what you have in your bank there and uh, I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Um, do you bench Foden then if you have a decent sub? Yeah, I probably would. Um, that's mad, a hat-trick for Foden. And then uh, he's uh, he's benched this week. Absolutely crazy. Um, right, Tarek, you're on, you're on the Patreon then as well. You're, you're sending your team. Um, two free transfers. Mm. Gusto, Gabriel, Udagi, Van Heck. The cells, Salah, Saka, Son, Palmer, Garnacho, Isaac, Solanke, Haaland. Right, Tarek, just got back to you there on Patreon. Uh, could you see Haaland get benched now as well? Is it worth starting him? I think I think Haaland should start. Um, Pep single-handedly giving FPL managers anxiety every week. Yeah, no, I think... Uh, let's see if we do get Haaland news, but first off, Foden is, is, very, uh, is very surprising. Uh, 5,645, 55 of hitting 5700 and um, if you are new if you're watching me for the first time please head on down there click subscribe and um, i really really would appreciate it and um, great return though on the stream so far this morning and um, right back to the chat here thoughts on alvarez i don't have any city assets probably would stay away from to be honest with you you might get the start but let's see if we uh, get closer news to the deadline news closer to the deadline i still have injured watkins connor but also don't have palmer do a sell midfielder from my bench and play a fifth mid instead of watkins or should i just do a forward transfer instead of watkins or do both palmer's priority definitely palmer priority there Um, it's what i would do Um, definitely 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 Everyone is panicking in the Patreon group. Apologies now, just have to get back to everyone. Does Foden start? No, he does not. Um, Let's get back. Just brought Foden in, Joe. No, you didn't. No. Uh, Michael, do let us know what you have in, in the in the bank there. I don't know if you oh yeah, one point five million in the bank. So for Morris. Jeez, we're multitasking here between the stream and, and Patreon and everything, right? I'll I'll get back to everyone, don't worry though. I will get back to everyone. Uh Michael, one point five million in the bank. So Morris is how much? Um five and a half. So you six and a half for a striker. Um, six and a half. If Alvarez is starting, Michael Alvarez could be a shout if you if you are wildcarding soon, or Cunha could be a shout as well. Maybe Cunha, 
Kuhn in. Um, let's see if Alvarez is starting, Michael. He could be a nice punt that could could potentially pay off. Um, let's see on that. Definitely, that could be that could be a shout there. Um, Michael Glenn, uh, nothing in the bank. Jesus, that's that's tough now. Right, back to the chat here then as well. Let me know what you think of that, Michael. Where is he gone? Son Palmer, Salah Darwin or Saka Captain. I can't make my mind up. I'm on I'm on Palmer, that's what I would say. Um Not sure if Charlotte is in the chat here then as well. Um, no Saka news yet. Keep me informed, pal. I will, Michael. Definitely, I'll have it into the Discord. Um, oh, yeah. I better put that into the Discord then as well in case anyone isn't watching the stream. What's there? Then? Good man, William. I love that. You're, you're third day at the wedding and you're in the car watching watching the stream that a shout out William in the chat Jesus Christ that is outrageous watching the stream in his car because he's no headphones that is class William love that man that is class um, right back to this third 20, 29 minutes to go um, that's uh, Johnny Sexton has a as Foden so I, I, I've had to tell him to to decide what he wants to do there good stuff right um, it's mad the people who play this game it's absolutely crazy um, right news on Sackett none yet just want to get David Mannion right let's get into you um, if Alvarez is starting Michael back to that he could be a nice punt um, is what I would say because you've know, if you, if you no know Haaland uh, right Michael Coops as well. Let's get straight into Coops and then David then as well and Chewy then as well. Right, bear with me one sec. Just making sure everyone in the Patreon is um Right, just making sure everyone on the Patreon is happy. Jesus Christ, they're flying in. I'll literally get back to you in one minute here. And um, just getting back to the Patreon. Uh, good stuff. Right. Well, I'm doing this. Um, if you want to sub to the channel, if you aren't already, please do hit that subscribe button below. Uh, the pay the Patreon is <laughs> flipping off here now. I really apologize, but give the stream a like. And if you are watching and you're not subscribed already, please do uh, hit that subscribe button below. Patreon is going mad here. If anyone wants to become a member of, a page, if, of the Patreon, head on down there. But the Patreon is losing its mind at the moment. Um, Petrovic in goals. Good stuff then as well. We have 74 watching in the chat. I appreciate you all tuning in this morning. And we're 
55 away from hitting their 5.7k goal before the end of the stream if you are watching and you're not subscribed please do hit that subscribe button below connor darwin or Isaac. darwin if you if, if you or Isaac, if you have your free hit left darwin if you don't have your free hit so get darwin in for that double game week in 34 um is what i would say um Right, nearly done with these messages. Um, all right, one more message. Is it Barney and Foden out? Right, we're getting back to this chat because the Patreon is causing absolute hassle at the moment. Um, right, good stuff. Back to back to the stream here. The Patreon is going to go up again in a minute or two. Uh, 54 away from hitting our 5.7k goal. 73 watching. Uh, if you are new to the channel, if you're seeing me for the first time, Head on down there, click subscribe, I really would appreciate it. Um, and uh, click click like on the stream. How do we on, on the stream then as well? Great return this morning on today's stream. But um 70 watching, great stuff, 73 likes. Right, back to the back to here, coops, apologies. All over the place at the moment. Um hey, what's up, mate? Here we are again. This is how my team is looking currently. Main concern is having no eight nor no arsenal defence. Uh considering dropping one of the mids or four, it's a fun another defender, but I'm stuck. What do you think? Two free transfers, 0 0.3 in the bank, free hit, 34. Um, two free transfers, I just go Lascelles, I know you have Van Heck already. Can you get Lascelles in for eight Nori? Or eight Nori in for Lascelles and play him over Bradley is what, is what I would do there. Coops, hopefully you can do that. That's what I would say there. Do let us know on stream if you are still watching. Chewy FPL, good man, Chewy FPL. Right, we're going to race through these. Um. Foden will be benched, maybe he will be. Um, what else have we? Uh, Palmer, Vice, Salah, Captain, Morris, Dowdy, Gabriel, Udogi, Zabarni, Double Bournemouth might let you down there, to be honest with you. Um, no Foden, so that's all right. Morris, first sub. If you could nearly go Dowdy to eight Nori there, Chewy, I probably would. I'd go for it. He's a nice short-term pick. Right, David, we're finally getting to you now. Um, the Brav King goes, that's fine. Let's get the 100 likes, William, there. Two and a half hours of streaming. Man deserves those likes. I appreciate that. We're 27 away from... Uh, 25 away from 100 likes. Yeah, but I've been streaming since half eight, so early morning, as William says there. Um, if you are watching for the first time, please do head on down there. Click subscribe. I really, really, would have, really, really would appreciate it. Um, 54 subs away. Um, 22 minutes ago until the deadline, so... Um, please head on down there, click subscribe. But back to David here. De Bravkin goes Saliba, Gabriel, and Burn in defence is fine. Another Patreon member there as well, Jared. If you are in the chat, uh, let's get you sent this message then as well, Jared. I really do appreciate that, man. Um, let's get you added in straight away then. Um, Jared, if you're watching this, really appreciate it, man. Um, I'm sending you the message there. Get into the group chat there if you can at all before the deadline if you are watching. And uh, let's get this up then and running. Right, 22 minutes to go. Jared, if you are watching, good man. I really appreciate the Patreon membership. Um, right, good stuff. If I open this. Right, um, what are we on there now? Uh, right, back to the Patreon here. 82 likes, appreciate that as well. We're uh, we're nearly at 100 likes, as, as uh, William requested there. Uh, we'd only have 4.2 coops, so back to your team there. Um, 
oh, you want Brad, you can't even afford Brantwith there. Um, you're not going to like it, but if you have two free transfers, you go to sells to Taylor. I know it's a, it's burning a transfer, but you're getting a player that plays over the sales. But it's it's not ideal, Coops. I'm sorry, but that's what just because. Thomas, it's gross. Brady instead of Foden. Neither three options are appealing to me as an Arsenal fan. I don't want gross to return. Best of luck and thanks. Hope you get to 6k subs. Appreciate that, man. Right, people are asking me, what about Richards of Crystal Palace? I'm just going to check how long he's out for. Um, 27th of April. No, he's going to miss the double game, is he? Yeah, he's going to miss it. Yeah. Taylor. If you can hear that alarm, that's my, uh, that's my, um, Reminder to do my own transfer myself. Um, oh, no, it's not. Right, Dave, we'll go back to yours. Right, I um, think that is everyone sorted. Right, back to this. Reminder to make the sub, yeah, I'm wounded. It, it, it's, it can be very stressful before the deadline, but we're making sure we're, we're doing that. 52 subs away from hitting our 5,700K goal. If we can get anywhere close to 5.7, it'd be very much appreciated. But right, back to this. I need to make my own transfer myself. So my transfer, I'm probably going to wait an extra eight minutes. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to set another alarm for 10 to in case we do get any second news but for now it's just going to be Lascelles to Van Heck in preparation for bench boost uh, 37 Right, Patreon is still popping off. Foden was the most transfer player in this week. Yeah, it's mad. KDB starts. Um, let's have a quick look on Twitter now. Um, that's why you don't make early transfers with uh, with with this game. Um, it's mad. It honestly is. It's crazy. Um, Foden not starting. That's fine. KDB starts. Fair enough. No Hallen news yet. We still have Hallen news to get then as well. Uh, do I rate teams? Um, I do I do indeed send them in there if you can at all um, 52 subs away um, if you can at all sub to, sub to the channel it'd be very funny if Salas hits out it's the, it's the reason why you have to have a, have a strong enough bench then as well we saw during the week then Garnacho uh, getting those returns um, Right, Jared, if you're in the chat there, appreciate you for becoming a member. Um, I 
don't know if you can hear that weather outside as well right David I did get I did get to your team but I'll get back to you now apologies um, who's that starting John Stone starts for City right David we're getting to your team now um, this is the thing as well if you want priority um, I'll have to message back all my Patreon members first um, apologies about that um, but they are paying for support 50 subs away from um, from our, our 5.7k goal and our, and our YouTube members I have to make sure they're all sorted um, Um, right, let's get back to this Saka news, not yet. Right, good stuff, right, that's the Patreon, calm down a bit. Right, uh, start Watkins if you have them, I think so, yeah. Um, right, that's the Patreon sorted. Let's get back to this chat then as well. How are we looking here? Right, David, we need to get back to your chat. Um, we lost a sub there. Hopefully it wasn't you, David, because I'm going back to your team now. But uh, if that's all right. Two free transfers for David. Um, what's Jack saying? Salah captain over Palmer is tempting as a United fan. I could see us getting battered. I think so too. But yeah. Right, David's team here. Dubravka, Saliba, Gabriel. Um Two free transfers, Madison, Palmer, Saka, Son, Ward-Prowse, not Madam Ward-Prowse, the front, front three are fine, you can bench Ward-Prowse, um, Madison, Palmer, Saka, Son is fine, and, and probably make a defensive transfer, so probably would go Doughty, Tate, Nori, and roll the other transfer, David, that's what I would do, hopefully that's alright for you, David, and um, got back to you there, good man, David, sound, yeah, just um Doughty to Aitnori and roll the other transfer. Three four three two two Arsenal Dubravka Aitnori and that's what I would say. Yeah, good stuff. Right, um, what are we? Thirteen minutes to go until the deadline. I'm think I'm locked in on, on Palmer captain. We've got a few more. Adam here, one free transfer going to roll. Bradley Gusto Gabriel Foden on the bench. That's fine. Yeah, that's all good there. Good man. Good stuff. Right, make sure the patron. Everyone else is fine. Right, good stuff. Um, it'd be very funny if Salah sits out, in fairness. Yeah. So we're saying that Sack is definitely a hold for now if we don't hear news, even if it's a transfer. Yeah, I've I've got um, I've got Garnacho on the bench, so that's what I would say. I've, I've, I'm covered if, if Saka does miss out. Um, but yeah, shout out to Tinkerbell as well for having me up on screen there on, on our TV at home. Right, 10 minutes to go until the deadline. Let's... Um, Let's see there. 50 subs. We got our sub back. Good sub. I'm just going to make me transfer now, I think. Um, it's LaSalle's. Very, very boring. One free transfer. LaSalle's in for... Good stuff. Jesus, I thought the laptop just crashed there, but we're fine. Uh, LaSalle's in for Van Heck. It always... I think when we've loads of people watching us, the, the laptop goes goes AWOL. But um, did we hit our 100 likes? Let's see. Um... 89 likes we're 11 likes off and as i said if you're new to the channel and if you are watching please please do hit that subscribe button below right i'm i'm comfortable quite content on that van heck in for the cells and uh, maybe i'll just make the transfer now because i don't think um i want to be rushing before the deadline uh start kiwi or brandwell i think kiwi or is going to be on the bench so maybe brandwell in there or maybe you can you can start him over over um and hope hope he does he does play um yeah i'm i'm a Oscar Oscar's playing Saka. I was chatting to Oscar last night and he's he's a, he's fairly content that uh Saka should play, so um that doesn't mean anything but Oscar has has his sources. Um but 
he, he didn't he didn't have a source last night but if he's happy with Saka playing that's what I'm going to do right uh, Saka is staying in the team Lascelles in for Van Heck confirmed transfer Van Heck last on my bench he's, he's fine there for the double later on the season um, right let's get back here that's my alarm for doing my transfers transfer is done 10 minutes to go until the deadline let's get back to everyone as quick as possible now right start gusto or Garnacho? gusto i think yeah i'm i'm uh, I, I would uh, would start the what is going on here with this we're fine we're still going laptops having a a panic attack are we still streaming hopefully we are um youtube just crashed i think we had too many on stream uh hopefully we are still streaming um or hopefully we didn't crash there um i'm gonna have to get another laptop up there yeah we're still streaming i think do let us know uh, i'm gonna have to get this laptop up hopefully we are still streaming yeah we are that's good i can get this up here how's the chat still going if it is let us know Um, maybe i'm going to too long on this i think that's why the laptop is 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 a uh, is dying yeah we're still going here anyway right uh they would take a minus four to bring in salah i'd uh, i'd go for it 